bleary eyed, but uh, we are going to be playing some D and D, proper D and D, fifth edition. Oh God, I didn't change the. All right. Anyway, I am here oh, with uh, the DM, Fluffy Bunny Feets, and hello, Almighty Spoon. Hello. Howdy ho. Howdy ho. Who uh, will be, uh, uh, yeah, will be doing this adventure. Uh, Scaramouche Boy will also be joining us at some point, but uh, not tonight. However, this is uh, apparently an Adventure League game, I'm told, so that's kind of drop yeah. in and drop out. Uh, I did create an official character uh, that will work for Adventure League. Oh, God. You're very spiny. I just looked at your Sweet. picture. Uh, I was just looking for oh, there we go. Kind of look like a Gila monster. Gila it monster? looks like uh, look like one of those uh, one of those lizards with the see you saw in Jurassic Park the first one. Right, right. It's, they uh, they open up they open up their yeah, their, yeah the ones that like spat that yeah yeah the ones that spat on uh, uh, Newman. That so gross. Uh, okay, uh, first I want you to go in and uh, in make a journal <sighs> entry. On your uh, adventures, Captain's log notes. supplemental. Yeah, if you if you go to your adventure log, you should make another log. Right. And then click the dragon in the dragon. You should on top write this adventure number. Put it in there. I will drop it in chat. Just you can so you can drag and drop. Okay, one second. Um... Notes Luskin. Really, Dungeons and Dragons isn't a isn't a freaking um, option for for streaming. What what do we? Oh, fantasy grounds. It it is on if you write write Dungeon and Dragons, you sh it should pop up as an option. It's more common than hmm. Dungeon Dungeons and Dragons Shadows over Mystara. No, just Dungeons and Dragons. What the fuck? Man? Dungeons and Dragons Heroes. Dungeons and Dragons. It, 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 it's oh my god, I can't I can't spell. There we go. Actual D D fifth edition. New so it's campaign. an official Adventure League game. Uh... What the hell? Now now it froze. I'm not I'm not having a good time of it. Chatbot just went like. Ooh, no. Pull the fuck this shit I'm out. Mm hmm. Fuck this shit I'm out. Uh uh, uh uh. Wow, it really died. What the fuck? It's not responding. Wait for the program to respond. Wait for the program um, to stop being a little bitch. All right, there so you go. I'm copying this. Put it in. Uh, cl click the dragon head and just I drag it. it on top of the adventure. Go to go to, to, to get your uh, adventure sheet up. Yeah, just double click on. Yeah. Go to journal. Journal. There's no, no journal. Log, I'm at. And log. click on the log. dragon head. No, that, that you. That was right. You were at the right point there. All right, and, and we're there's gonna... adventures. Adventures. Right. And there's a. There's a line there with a dragon head. Click on the dragon head. Just drag it on on the up on top there. Well, oh, wait, wait now. <laughs> what did I just do? What I do? What I do, kids? What am I dragging? Where? The session name here? Yeah. Okay. It's uh. Yeah. Why did like that, that not work? Because it's. Oh, it did now. It did now. Okay, there we go. Yeah, I was opening it. Uh, right. Okay, and. Your starting XP should be zero. Uh, session one, uh, uh, it was session number one? Yeah, session number one. Date 2018. Yeah, and uh, I will give you a, a oh, picture God, and uh, you, you get my, my dungeon, dungeon Master uh, ID. Just give me a sec here. Game name and DCI. The Fluffmeister. Fluffarama. Fluffarumi. All right, never mind. Hmm. So I've got a common and draconic. Let's go. We can with... fucking find it. All right, people are thinking I'm playing something else right now because Chatbot decided to take a shit and die. Oh man, I cannot wait for my new heatsink to come. Uh, 
just tired of the fan going every time I launch a game. It's freaking obnoxious. Yeah, I'm sure the broken hard, little dragon head, try and drag it onto adventures, okay. and I get unable to find record uh, to match like drop. Bacon, do not show this to anybody in, in stream. I will show you a picture. This so if you can Oh uh away. hang on a second, let me switch the input so yeah. you don't see it. Yeah. Okay. Now it is dark. Dark. Dungons and dragons. Put that name in there and that number in there, the log. Oh, okay. I still love your name, dude. <laughs> the adventures log. Yeah. Uh, for under the it. session, right? Starting XP is zero. Yes. Yeah. Yeah, uh, starting gold, gold start is ten. Yeah. Downtime, downtime is, is zero. Zero. Renown magic is zero. Is zero. Ain't nobody. And know. magic item is zero. Okay. And then and... Uh, this will change during the course of the game. If you have any notes of the adventure, you can put it down in adventure, adventure notes, notes. Downtime activity. Okay. Uh, now, if I close this and I open it up again, is it going to mask your name? Uh, no. So I'm always gonna have to switch this if I edit this area. Yeah, you can add it off stream if you want to. Yeah, yes, you know what? The faction and the DCI is that section. Right. Yeah. Okay. It's very important because that is my DCI number if you want to. Because that makes it official. All right, and it's automatically saved, right? Now, if I double click on this yeah. thing, it will pop now, up again. Where is I was trying to add the uh, treasure of the broken horde to my adventure list, but it says unable to find record to match. Uh, you, see, you, you see, there's a. Uh, Dragon head right below it, yeah. Yeah, don't drag that. Okay. Drag the name onto just, just onto the, the onto name. The, onto adventures, and then it opens up. Uh, uh, okay. Uh, what you need to do is click on the edit button down at the lower okay. right. Okay. So I, and, and then so the well, plus sign. Let me close this. That would help you a lot. Ah, it? That worked. Yeah. So you Did put the session number line. one, the the date, and the night. <coughs> And design number, and then you put in your starting XP, your gold, your downtime. Uh, downtime will uh, give you that is basically time you can do uh, while you're not adventuring. Like you will get a certain amount each adventure. Renown is if you're a member of a, um, a organization that will give you that is uh, how they. Uh, if you do missions for them, they will you get renowned as, and then you you have a chance of increasing rank. Okay. I don't remember my starting gold. Let me go to my. I think it's quick. ten. Inventory. It's probably ten. Everything yep. is in gold, by the way. There's no silver. There will not no, really. be. Don't have to deal with no, that crap. No. no. Is Everything like... is in gold. Okay. Gold. And downtime. Hello's gold. And renown just leave it zero. I'm guessing. Renown is zero, and uh, just that is just starting. Okay. And just leave downtime blank then. Yep. Or you can just write uh, a zero on it. I'll write a zero just so it makes sense. Yeah. Game name and DCI. That would be the same thing again. Now should you can I, switch back to bacon. Should I put some music down? No. Well, you're gonna you're gonna have some music, right? I have uh, sound effects if you yeah. want. Yeah. Uh, all right. I've no. activated the sound effects, so we can start with with the drunken bard song. Because we have a drunken bard with us, don't we? Yeah, I, I, I like the sauce. Oh, he's too drunk. So I don't need that faction and stuff on the adventure notes instead of all being that adventure itself. What? You say again? I opened up my log and initially I had your name set as a faction at the DCI number. I think no, I don't you, need that. No, you just need to put it in the log. Okay. The adventure log itself. Gotcha. Yeah. We don't have Do a faction name? yet, right? Or you do? 
PC. Yeah. Uh, well, you you can okay. Uh, yeah, you, uh, the factions you find if you go to the official Adventure League uh, site, mm -hmm. there is a description of all the factions. Yeah, I'm, I'm going to be a free agent for now. Yeah. I'm just the not, I'm not gonna factions bother. will give you some advantages, but it also uh, tie you up a little bit. Right. Yeah. I I'm can't not... see my character having been yeah, in a faction. It is. It, it is. It, it is a choice of your own. You can. You yeah. can choose the faction semen. anytime. Okay. Uh, first of all, uh, before we start, I have to congratulate you on being uh, um, s selected. Uh, to oh wait, I need to get my adventure. I there apparently we go. need to fix my HP because it didn't update when I changed my stats around. It's uh, it's uh, dice ten plus you come. <laughs> that die is an eight. Oh, is this me playing? Because it, it's probably me playing. It's 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 uh, not a very good uh, bard. No, well, I know. I think I'm better than this. Shit, even drunk, I probably play better. <laughs> This guys like still training. Out. You can see him sitting there by the fire with his tongue out and try to like figure out how to put the fingers. Oh, like this? He's like. Uh. <laughs> I should probably open your stream on the side so I can. He's he's got that. Chat. He's got that overbite like uh, dudes dancing to have sometimes. Yeah. <laughs> you can see his tongue sticking out while he's sitting by a fire and everybody every patron in the inn is sitting and quinching like, oh no <laughs> I'll I will pay him to stop play. Uh, hmm. But then we're gonna have some nice songs in let, let's hear. Because on one hand, are... I'd like to throw him face first into the fire. But on the other hand, <laughs> is it is this like open mic night? Can I walk up to him and say, uh, uh, "Next, please"? Uh, no, nah, well, the, the the music is not there really. Oh, but, all right, oh yeah, all right. That's but, just that, okay. That's not actually happening. No, uh, because uh, before I we start, I just uh, as I said mentioned before, I I would like to congratulate you on being um, chosen. As uh, being uh, the personal assistance to help tr tracking down some uh, caches of treasure hidden by the now defunct cult of the dragon, and I mean assist uh, one of the most famous treasure hunters in the realm, called Verada Store, and she had Verada put Store. out a call of assistance to track down those caches. Uh, uh, the, uh, the uh, caches that are hidden in the now uh, in the renowned mountains of Grey Peak. Uh, Grey Peak is one of the like I will show you exactly which uh, we're talking about. Uh, first, let's talk about the the cult of the dragon. There was a cult that uh, basically tried to uh, to summon. The, the mother of all dragons, the, the dragon god, and it utterly failed and uh, got crushed by some adventures way back in the days. Wow, who's writing that fast? About typing. Okay. Yeah. Do, 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 so, do, 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 Okay, Grey Mountains is, is way up there. So you... You have been called to meet this Verada store, this famous Verada store. Okay. Uh, at um, at a along um, a, at a clearing uh, along the black road east of the village Parnast. Parnast is basically a shithole. It's like a town in the middle of nowhere. But but you you uh, you're now walking towards the meeting place. Okay. Uh, and your trip along the black road has shown signs of goblin presence, but otherwise it's been very une uneventful. You've been on, on the road for days by now. You have s Other claimers you have met have claimed to have seen evidence of giant activity in the area also. That means they have seen rune-covered boulders, they have seen huge footprints, and they have seen missing livestock. But you have seen uh... none of those, none of those things on your journey until now. However, it, it could be just the overactive imagination of some scared farmers or merchants or whatever. I don't know. So, uh, it's midday. 
uh, on your right side you have like a huge forest uh, lining uh, following you along the this black road this black road is quite famous because it's the it runs uh, uh, over the Roshar desert and uh, and it's one of the one of the maybe most important trade routes and mo one of the most parallel trade routes in in the in the vicinity it's really it, it can be very dangerous uh, as I said before, you, you, you have, uh, you've seen sign of goblins in the area, but you, and you heard about the, the, the dwarf or the giant activity, but you haven't seen any proof of it. So it could be just imagination because giants are not uh, are very rare to see in this area. But you you arrive to the clearing, okay, where you're supposed to meet with other store, and to your dismay, you can see that it's signs of a fight some sort of fighting ad that has happened here quite recently great yeah and uh, you can see there are the ground is marred with blood and uh, you can see there are a lot of footprints around here and you cannot see any sign of this Verada store by the way you never met her before you just got uh, got lucky or by accident or by sheer luck or by your if you had any organization behind you that tried to help you there we go you mentioned signs of goblin activity any way to tell if footprints are from goblins uh, there are countless footprints here from of various sizes uh, here and uh, you can see uh, well what you can do is do uh, okay. do some either a natural or a, or a survival role to see if you see any any footprints that can that stands out survivals that he just drag the ability yeah what you can do is uh, there are several ways of rolling a die in this game it one is to double click on the dice on the, on the far left mm -hmm. or you can drag it and drop it into your chat window or you can drag it down to your short bar down at the bottom there you have a lot of short bars and then you just need to click on it and it will, it will so, so you can either use survival or in nature to, to, oh, to can't check resize out. this thing. Huh? That's a plus four. So, uh, I don't... if you want to resize it, just pick it in 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 the bottom there. I can resize it for you. There you go. Ah, just need it to fit. Which, uh, why can't I resize it myself? That's weird. Just. Yeah, you can do it. Just. Oh, no, it really. The, it's. I swear, it didn't left, let me do that before. Left, le left no, I got it now. Yeah. Ah, here we go. Or you can hold, or you can hold con control and use the. Oh, I got that to come up properly. Why well, this program's running so slow for me? All right. Anyway, uh, actually... nature looks like it's gonna be nature for me. So. Yeah. Just double click on the nature uh, die, um, and uh, we will see what. What do you get? Wow! What a shitty roll. That was a really bad roll. We're that off to a promising you... start here. Yeah. You you see there at least. Sorry, mine didn't actually count the roll for some reason. I'm guessing because of where it landed. That didn't do so good either. That, but it's wow, enough. we suck. Uh, it's <laughs> enough that you see there's a trail of blood leading towards the edge of the forest. To what it seems to go. Is on the, the blood edge. shaped in an arrow? <laughs> it's, yeah, it's that obvious. It they came from it here. Is, it says written on the side. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. It's basically <laughs> and Heinklis didn't even notice that. He was like more worried about all the footprints. And you, uh, Heinklis, probably uh, think that it is at least ten or nine or twelve. Ah, you lost it. Oh, ah, you have no idea how many it is. God, there must be fifty guys here. Yeah. Oh my God, it's a whole army. But you, there is obviously been some sort of fighting here. That is I'm true. Guessing our characters have been traveling for a while to get here. Y then. Yeah, you probably traveled here for at least uh, ten day or maybe a little longer. Cool. to get here it's it's in the middle of nowhere the, i mean to your to your east you have the forest like a big forest to your uh, to the west you have the gray mountains basically and the trail leading to the forest you. or toward the mountains uh the trail goes towards the forest so uh yeah and it's it is it, it's like somebody has dragged its body along or being dragged along the grass towards but you don't see anybody here 
The only thing you can hear is the bird, the sound of birds. You can probably hear it. Odd that the birds are in this area. There was a fight recently. Uh... I think they'd be a little more disturbed not coming back this quickly. I have no idea. All I know is it looks <laughs> like there were, there were like 50 guys here at one time, so that's, that's yeah, kind of nuts. Yeah, it's probably been a, like an epic fight here, probably. Must have been quite the battle. It probably has. Well, we got a trail But, you, but you would be here. employees nowhere to be seen. It's about the only thing I've got. Well, I guess we should follow the, the trail then. You don't know the, about the trail. The only one that knows is that dragon. I just mentioned that as well. Okay. Okay. <laughs> then, then when he points it out to you, uh, Hankless, oh. you can see the blood tray. Oh, God. How did I miss that? Damn. That was so obvious. It was so uh, almost like an arrow. Of blood. I might as well have used red paint. <laughs> yeah. Shall we uh, go after them? Well, if we want to get this job done and over with, probably the best idea. Okay, uh, you follow the blood trail, and you don't go far, you just go like maybe 50, 60 yards, and you see there's a body lying on the ground. It's uh, basically your uh, body of a... Um, of a... Uh, Vanessa? Your would-be employee. Is she alive? And uh, No, 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 she's very dead. She's probably been dead for hours. She's been. God. You can see there are several wounds on her body, like stab wounds. She's she's put up a really good fight, but she's staring dead at you. Uh, and at what is left of her equipment is scattered about the the clearing. Uh, but what you can see is near her body, you can see there's a large tomb that holds her uh, notes that are open now near her body, and you can see their last several pages have been torn out. Great. Uh, Guess and that's more your speed than mine. Uh, sure. Why not? Yeah, let's go with that. Uh, I take a look at the tome. You're a bard. Yeah. Oh, no, I, uh, I know. Said, I'm playing uh, that in character. Yeah. <laughs> you, you, you can see. You can. You yeah, quickly. Dude, you're gonna hurt your voice with that gra with the, with the gravel. Ah, uh, it's fine. Mm -hmm. You, uh, you can what? quickly deduct by by looking at the book that the, the pages that are missing is basically that the, it will uh, tell you the direction to to the the caches she was she has learned about. Oh, she had notes or on the cache are... locations. Okay. Okay, so you had uh, they they basically her personal notes, and uh, but you, the, the the as I said the the direction to those caches are torn out. Mm -hmm. Any of her equipment salvageable? Yeah. Uh, also, well, I, ser no, I search her body. Most, most, oh, oh, there you go. Now you found the uh, in on her body. You found uh, um, she has some. Uh, looks like extra copies of these notes in the form of scrolls. She's she's clever. This Verada right. storm. All right. I motion. Uh, and, I motion the dragon born over and and and, uh, and will, open them up yeah. with him. Yeah. Look him over. And uh, there you go. So we should add that to our Please. blog. Oh yeah, right. How do I do that? Let's go with notes. Wait, uh, I have to edit, right? Edit this thing. Uh, where where should we add this? Uh, to your no notes, you cannot add it to your uh, journal. Okay, so That's we're... Oh, no, it's right here. I'm sorry. Yeah. Uh, notes. Try dragging it over there. Nothing. You just need to make a note. Like, ah. right-click, add, make a note, and then drag it into that note. Uh, Open it up. Get that. No. G go to your note tab on the right. I'm, on, I'm at the notes tab. Oh, not on my character sheet? No. Yeah, that's where I was as well. Oh, uh, all right. That's what. All right. It's like Cthulhu then. It's the same thing. Yeah, it is the same thing. Where is the freaking notes? Thing? I can see there's a note called from Almighty Spoon there. There's Luskin. There's a note about Luskin. Yeah, I'll take that away because it's not supposed to see that. <laughs> it's like the end of the game. No, it's uh, different players. I, I use the same server for different players. Okay, Sometimes there we are. Great item. Share. Boom. If, if Owner likes like the bacon. People. Now I want to drag this. You know, that's what I hate is that. No. 
They the they never fix this thing the way they do. There we go. Verata store notes. Okay. So sure should, should I guess we should read these now. <laughs> these are the notes that you were able to put together based on your scouring of the notes you found in the body of Verata store. The first cache. The first cache is hidden by the Cult of the Dragon in an abandoned cave at the base of the southernmost mountain in the Great Peak Range. While it was thought to be the smallest of the caches, it also it is also not thought to be protected by any traps or magic. The caves and tunnels are, of the complex, according to my sources, are not very structurally sound. Goblins are known to inhabit the area. Second cache. I, I don't. Should I keep reading this or? Yeah, do, just right. do it. My sources confirm that one cache was buried beneath a unique structure, a pyramid of stone resting on a flat field of stone in the middle section of the Grey Peaks, directly between the two highest mountains on the, of that section of range. The area was once rent with volcanic activity, making the flat stone field difficult to navigate. My sources cannot tell me who or what built the boulder pyramid. Oh boy. The third cache. Uh, oh, there's five of them. All right. Source I question about this cache said it was carefully hidden behind a secret entrance in the wall of a green-sided mountain. There's only one of those in the Great Peak Range, according to my research. The source also said the cultist who hid the treasure was an expert in magical curses. Oh, that's going last. Uh, the fourth cache. This cache was secured <laughs> in an abandoned uh, dwarven outpost uh, used for treating ore that was being prepared for use in weaponsmithing. My sources imply that the place has been overrun by something terrible and immortal, causing the dwarves to leave it centuries ago. Oh, boy. Uh, so third and fourth are most likely the last ones we want to do. Yeah, yeah. I, I really don't want to go up against the Balrog right away. Uh, subterranean volcanic activity has been reported in the area regularly over the years. The fifth cache. At the top of the tallest summit of the Great Peaks, one contact told me that there is an abandoned shrine once revered by giants. Dragons use the area as a perch since then, and a cache is going to be hidden there. Someone told me that occasionally, when the wind is blowing just the right direction, a pealing of loud bell can be heard from there. Hmm. Gone. Yeah, I'm going to go with uh, uh, first cache, Alex. One or two. The first is the one that is closest. Yeah. That's probably going to take you a couple of days to reach from where you're at. Where Do you're we have the supplies for that? Uh, I don't know. Because we've been on the road for 10 days. Do we need to go back to town no, to resupply? No, or? no. no. Uh, let's check our uh, inventory. we got 10 days yeah. rations. Yeah. You have five days rations. So that should be enough. For a uh, small expedition. Where up, up. is the inventory? Oh, okay, that's how it works. All right, cool. So it wasn't like all right. Okay, just just to mention it, uh, there is something called uh, party inventory. If you go to your, uh, uh, you know where the, the combat tracker. There's a, there's a party sheet that has an eye with a lot of people on it. Cap will, cap. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Yerk. Nice. I will just blossom I will just... the barbarian. <laughs> yeah, that is, that, that is an old group. <laughs> Sorry. Dun, dun, dun. Now I got that Did stupid you? theme song in my head. Uh, oh, God, I used to I, watch that show. I'm going to put you in there. That means this is a... Uh, 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 that will... Uh, 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 first of all, it will show you... Um, there you go, Ugrath. And, Ugrath. And there's a party sheet inventory there. Yeah, That basically tells you... Tells you uh, I can drop items in there, so you can reach. You can drag stuff in there, and you put, and you can take stuff out there if there. Oh, I see. I and see. Then, okay, so right then, now. And then you, then you have order. I just need to delete because I. Have Marching formation. Yeah, I'm so guessing can... we're side by side here. Most likely. Yeah. Yeah, yeah I don't. So I don't see a reason. Uh... Yeah, I'm not, I'm not the you, most uh, perceptive also, fellow. Also, you can put in watch order, and then you have something called XP, but I'm, that is mm. for me. So. But it's just, just to mention, it's a very cool, handy thing you can look yeah. up and uh, that is have neat. a look at. Okay, uh, so you, uh, what are you going to do? D decide, so you're going to just leave her here? Is that it? Uh, all, all, you can already see signs that animals have started to nibble on her. Yeah, maybe we should do the uh, respectful thing here and bury her. Okay. So yeah, I, you know, I'd spend the time and, uh, you know, Sorry. dig a shallow grave. Sorry. Or at least deep enough, <laughs> deep well, enough well, that the, the animals ground, won't the, get to her. The the ground is quite soft there, so it's probably gonna take you an hour or so to 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 dig her a grave and put her down there and maybe say some nice words. All right, I, I'll answers. do it. It, it. it depends on your uh, beliefs. Well, I just think it's a decent thing to do, not to have yeah, her. I I don't really have 
Well, actually, Lathan. Wait, who, who's my god? <laughs> I completely forgot who, who my god is. My, my god. Where is my god? Wait, what the hell? What is going on? No, I seriously forgot my god's name. Lathander. Yeah, I was right. Lathander. I don't know. Yeah, what what would Lathander do? No, I actually stop and I think about it. What would Lathander do? So I'm assuming he would. Uh, he would probably show some respect for the dead and uh, uh, make the shallow grave, and uh, I'll, I'll, I'll handle it. I, I I look over at the the monk and say, uh, "You want to help me here, or uh, are you good?" Okay then. What? Never mind. I got it. All right. So I take care of it. Okay. Uh, okay, so you spend an hour and then you start doing your journey towards the first cache. Dun, 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 that is that, that's dun, dun, probably going to take you a couple of days, depending on the weather. But you have to start uh, ascending the uh, uh, the mountains to okay. to the uh, to the west. So we're at the base of the range. Yeah, and uh, but you follow the instruction of the. The, of the sign of, of the instruction on the scrolls and uh, you will uh, I name see if you can find the entrance to that but the instructions are quite good I mean they're really good in fact and you hmm. can hear almost the... too good yeah so we're gonna speed up time uh, okay. because this is an adventure league. It's, time goes really fast there. So we have a montage like uh, like you uh, and uh, yeah, it's it's the Fellowship of the guys. Ring. Us marching through, yeah, through Fellowship, the... yeah, marching for days, for a couple of days, and uh, during mid time, you're up in the mountains, and everything changed. It's it starts to get colder, and. Uh, Let's visit the mountains, you said. They're where the cute dwarves are. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, and af yeah, after My a couple of mountain. hours, oh, during sorry. the second day, you find the entrance that is mentioned in the... It's it's in the base of the... of, of, of this cave here. It's quite easy to spot, really, but it's like... Still, it's like uh, finding a needle in the haystack. And uh, you, Ow, as you stand there, the the, the, uh, I don't know. The, the, you know, there's sometimes rubble coming down from the from the mountainside. So it's oh it's right, this stony. this area is unstable. We got to be careful. We got to watch our step yeah. here. Uh, and uh, as you stand there, looking at the entrance to the uh, to the cave, it's quite dark. Uh, in the entrance, you can see uh, there is some footprints. Obvious footprints in front of the cave. I mean, this looks like this. Or old. Uh, yes, yeah. Well, do a do a nature or a survival roll, please, to to identify. So I'll help. Can... I'll help with that. Yeah. Sure. Why not? Suck less, right? Only skill I'm. Wow. <laughs> Four. Oh, you gotta or, go again, Henry, have no clue. You basically uh, like, oh yeah, there's. Yeah, like, of they so. appear to be tracks. <laughs> but Ulgrat saves the day with a, a score of 18. That means uh, you can you can deduct that the the, the the footprints is footprints from countless goblins. I mean, you can't even count them. You get to like 40, and then you can't count them anymore. Also, you see one or two sets of giant footprints. And possibly a bear. They all enters goes into the cave. Oh. Do, Lots do, of do. goblins, possibly a giant, and a bear for some reason. Oh, like this day wasn't fun enough already. Great. The question is, were they fresh or old? I, I watch him lean down and stick his finger in one uh, of the tracks, you, and then put the, the put his finger in his mouth. So, yeah. <laughs> You basically look at mm. it, sniff it, and you can deduct it's probably maybe four or five hours. Only a few hours ago. Okay, then we can't be far then. You, you, you. As you stand on, on the outside of the cave, you can't see anything. Like it's totally dark. So, 
Yeah, Madden I was actually eight. trying to find out if Dragonhorn had dark vision. I don't remember if they do. No, you I don't sure have so it. don't. No, uh, so you, you need some sort of light source. Do I have uh, torches? Yeah, let's do torches. I don't think I have a light spell or anything. Uh, where is it? It's under abilities, right? No. Inventory. Inventory is my spells? What? No. No. Oh, that would be uh, uh, abilities, yeah. Uh, abilities, yeah. Thank you. Uh, I have an... actions. Okay. Nope. My skills are all uh, uh, for fucking with people. Okay. Yeah, that's what parts do. Okay, so light up a torch. So you light up a torch, and uh, the torch uh, cast uh, the light in into the cave, uh, maybe maybe thirty feet or so into the cave, and uh, uh, and uh, you see the cave like start to dis uh, to uh, descend with a slight slope it, it towards uh, the uh, into the mountain basically, uh, and you as you, as I said before, you can see the 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 footprints leads into that dark cave. They branching off at all, or just all going straight? Uh, well, the, the the cave looks like it's going straight into darkness. I mean, it's uh, the light will just light up a certain amount of space in front of you. So, also, you know, with, with the light in your hand, uh, you know, you know that uh, you are basically a beacon in the in the dark. Yep. Just you know. Yeah. But what choice do you have? Yeah, well, outside of that, or you know. Or just get eaten by a groove. And uh, and you are adventures. Yeah. Well, nothing for it then. Let's push okay. on. Uh, you can go side by side and almost side by side. No, you can't. Uh, as you get like uh, maybe uh, further in there, the uh, the cave starts to narrow down a little bit. But it's still like uh, after you, good sir. Yeah. So for the best if I go in front. <laughs> As you you walk, uh, how are you walking quietly and uh, like? Yeah, uh, I'm gonna right? say quietly since I know there's giant in here. Okay. Well, that and uh, and the place is unstable. I'm not gonna go stomping about. You you can do a uh, stealth roll if you want to. I don't think we have much of a choice in this situation. Oh, someone's pouring rocks in our ears again. Sounds more like crumpling a plastic bag. But... <laughs> <laughs> Well, I'm not doing? stealthy. Stealth? All right. Well, well, let's try this. It's not going to matter. Because you're giving away your position. But uh... All right. Can I please can I please roll above five in this adventure? <laughs> Come on. What the fuck? Good at tracking. Not so good at uh, sneaking. I'm not so good at anything right now. Wow, I really okay. do feel like a bard. So, so you... <laughs> Yeah, useless. Uh, okay, so you you start Third to move edition. in. Uh, your 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 uh, your torch lights up enough so you can get a some sort of headway. What is what you see? The 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 actual um, hallway you're walking on uh, twists a little bit around, left to right, but it doesn't branch out. But after maybe ten minutes of walking in this cave. Uh, you see there's some light ahead of you like uh the cave opens up and you see there's light in front of or in front of you i, I guess and so you're like you you're probably like 40 40 feet from uh, from the opening of over uh, it seems like the 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 whole hallway or what you're walking on is branching out or a bit expanding out to some sort of cave in front of and there is light coming from that. I, I motion. Uh, I motion of the dragonborn to put out the torch. Yeah, I do it. Yeah, and then you turn into two shadows, basically standing there. Yeah, and the light is sufficient enough to so you can actually see there the the, the cave expands out in front of you. Anything uh, in there? Or just empty uh, cavern. Oh, you you approach it really cool, quietly because you try to stealth, but. I mean, I'm not approaching quietly. I mean, I rolled a two. Stop, I'm just stomping. Stop, stop, stop. I think we're you being really stealthy. Uh, you, you, know. you, you, thi you think you're stealthy, but... Rip one real loud as I we're walking up. I turn around and I'm, I, I, oh, he, uh, I turn him and I'm like, shh, really loud. <laughs> loud enough for the entire cavern to hear. We're, we're, we're horrible at this. Yeah, you're, you're brand new adventures. You're, this is probably your first real adventure. Like, as... Uh, um... 
possibly our last adventure. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> It's it could be considering how uh, things are yeah, going. Disclaimer: uh, These adventures can be healthy, uh, or you can you can actually die. It has happened. That's just D and D. Yeah, especially it's... at level one. Yeah, yeah, you, yeah you but just it can need to survive. Not the survive. more recent ones. I mean, that was like more like second edition, first edition. Where God, where... second edition was horrible. One. Yeah. Anyway, sorry. First, first connection lost. Also... Reconnect attempt one failed. Yeah, yeah, I got my, that too. My my dungeon and my. Uh, my fantasy ground crashed. What the fuck? Oh, that yeah. was the first time ever. It seems like the new patch has done something with the. Fantastic. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, reconnect attempt up. attempt three failed. Yeah, yeah, just, just wait. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna I wait. To get it up. Get, get it up again, and that sounded dirty. <laughs> All right, that's what she said. Oh, I missed that's golf. She said. Where's I golf? Gold already. Where's gold? <laughs> He's playing uh, Civilization. Oh, cool. Oh, does he, did he get the expansion? Because Rise and Fall came out. I don't think he bought it. I yeah, know gold. He doesn't buy it uh, like uh, the first thing he buys. So, side note, uh, I tried Offworld Trading Company today. It's a blast. I was enjoying yeah, yeah, it. Yeah, I saw you. That was, that was really cool. Trying game? Should we, no, just, should we just exit? Wait, uh, no, it kicked me out completely. Yeah, right. yeah because I had the service not up yet. Take some time because after the patch, everything has gone like really slow. I don't know why. Uh, there is some issues with memory leak, I think. They have introduced the 3.3.4 3. 3. 3. Uh, patch recently and they did a oh, lot of changes. Not... I actually downloaded GOG Galaxy. I don't like it. You downloaded what? GOG Galaxy because I was like, oh, okay, let me why actually would you download that. <laughs> uh, yeah, because then now it's like I'm trying to get Wing Commander options to work and whatnot, and I can't even access them. It's so annoying. Like, I want to play it windowed, and, and it's the DVD version, so it looks great. It looks a hell of a lot better than 3 did, but uh, yes. it's um, it's like try. it was too loud, and I couldn't change the settings. It was, it was freaking weird. Yeah, coming up. It has a guy that played... Uh, Kefler on, on Babylon 5 as I think the villain which I think is hysterical because he was like a dumb pilot in that show yeah like he didn't last long he didn't no he, he was he was like was this it, minor but, character but, but how is the game isn't it like every two like so old it's like you cringe every time you watch it like oh my god no. do I actually like that look look it, look at privateer and look at wing commander one and two and you'll be like okay you know, it's obviously yeah. dated. I mean, it's dated. It's dated no matter what, but I think with each progressive game, they got a little slicker, you know? Oh, I need to Ooh, switch. You so have seen me and Bacon's uh, streaming if you think we cringe on old games. Yeah. <laughs> Especially Bacon. Space I, Quest. Sometimes Space Quest. I, I Space Quest is cool, mind. though. I mean, okay. With the caveat. <laughs> it it, it was it. it was worse than Dark Souls for dying. Like I think Dark Souls was fairer about dying, and 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 that a lot of people disagree, but I think, you know, I like Dark Souls yeah. because it was so difficult. Right. No, it but it was never unfair. Difficult. It was difficult, but it was like you know the game kind of if you except if you for the Bed right, of Chaos, except for who? Bed of Chaos. That wasn't so bad though. But I, I guess that I also it just looked didn't at, fit with the rest of the game. <laughs> I also looked how to beat it. Yeah, it was like a multi-stage. Um, Go here, smack this once, 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 and pray you don't get knocked off the edge. Right, and you had to, you had to like, um... Didn't you have to, like, re-enter the area three times? That was the easy way to do it, yeah. Uh, yeah, well, <laughs> that was all okay. about doing it the easy way. You're smack the one the, thing the first time. You're safe on the way. way in again? I'm on my way in, I actually am in again. Yeah, cool. Uh, it's, um, you know what, uh, just a second, I need to... Yeah, my characters aren't there yet. I'll be right back. I need to put some food in the oven. Oh, I'm just chewing on a piece of pizza. <laughs> the fuck? Hmm? Oh, this is the wrong uh, uh, server I am put up. Shit. Okay, just give me a sec. Because there's no characters here. Exit. I need to return out to, to the launcher. Mm -hmm. right. 
I took the wrong D and D campaign in. My little grab a drink then. Yeah, just wait. Grab a drink. Do whatever you want to while I try to get this game up and running again. Fucking hey, that is the first time it's crashed on me. Where's the characters? What the fuck has happened? Oh, this is technical oh, difficulty, is it? Yeah, yeah, it is. Sometimes. Yeah. This is this is the first time in years, and something has ha happened to my data. I got kicked out again. Yeah, because uh, it's something the wrong. wrong. One. No, it wasn't. It's something wrong here. Uh oh. Yeah. Oh boy. Yeah. Sorry, per happened. person in the chat. <laughs> it's probably me. Or me. I have it open. I just, I'm trying to connect right now. Oh, there's the backup. Okay. Oh. Okay. Backed it up before you opened it, I take it. 27. Wait, it's February. Oh, does that mean we have to put the session in again? Ooh, I guess we're going to find out. might works and this is the first time in three years oh this is not the right one i know the background that's different. what i mean yeah there's something wrong here it's pretty to i like the it's leathery yeah i feel like i could run my head, hand across the screen Your database restored i need to uh... I need to uh, shut down again and, and get the right database up and running. No problem. Oh, it's actually looking um, at my... Oh, wait. I have to switch to that. There we go. So, how about that uh, sports team? Which sport team? I have no idea. I don't follow sports. <laughs> <laughs> the only sport I follow is sumo wrestling. I love sumo wrestling. Get out. Really? It's yeah, so I, random. I, 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 yeah. For the some weird reason, I, like, I like fatty, sweaty men fighting each other. I love oh. that. <laughs> that sound is so weird. Uh, where's Galt when you need him? Oh Something my god! Something about sumo wrestlers. Shall we try and uh, uh, should we try and join again? No, no. I'm uh, trying to reload the campaign here. Just give me a sec here. Right. There we go. Right theme. Why isn't it? Right. Why I'm going to put my technical difficulties on. Here we are. Right. I'm going to add the global source of the camera. Ah, Just that's not what I want to do. Technical difficulties. 
This is the first time in year. There you go. Bum, 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 oh bum, my bum. god! A huge head. <laughs> <laughs> so shiny! So these friggin' overhead lights, I had them angled for when my, my uh, desk was a little farther back. But now it's a little forward, so it's like... <laughs> like, you know, I could probably light the cavern with my forehead. Waiting for my delicious egg rolls there, to be ready. Yeah, there we go. I just need to figure out because this has never happened to me before, so I need to figure out how to get it back again. Maybe I should play a quick game of Excite Bite. Derek, there, yeah, go. Now we no, got it. I'm I, kidding. I know how to do it now. Open and go to campaign. I'm going to actually see what's on sale this weekend because, like, I don't have enough games. Witcher 3. Again. Still. Free Space oh. 2. I actually have that already. Now, there's a game I wanted to play. Maybe I should Free do Space that. was damn good. Well, Free Space 2 was at one time considered the greatest space sim ever. Yep. And that was like during that period when I didn't have a machine that was good for this. <laughs> and then I was like, when, when GOG came out, and it's like, oh, well, we have this now. It was one of the earlier... I remember when they finally announced it, I'm like, download it, bought. You know, I didn't care. So 10 bucks, that's a, that's a good deal. EverQuest 2, that's actually still around. Astroneer. You know what? I'm gonna... Here, you guys can see what I'm doing. And there's there. something that I haven't checked, but they have Earth Siege 2. Hmm. Never played those. It's a weird I... Mech Warrior style game. Yeah, I know. Okay, let's try to see if this works. Space Pirates and Zombies 2. I hear this game's actually a lot of fun. A friend of mine has it. Looks looks very colorful. Kerbal Space Program? Away with, away with words? What? Reassembly. Yeah. Ba, 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 this game, Steam has been pushing hard the sci-fi stuff. It's seen, uh, you know, ever it, since it, I started playing of... Elite regularly, it's like here, yeah, yeah, here's yeah. seventy-five thousand other space sims. Been playing. Yeah, no, I yeah, know it's, it's annoying. Busy. It's annoying though. It's like show me like, it, show me random I want, shit. I want the adventure game. Right. I mean, but it's all of the. All of this has been space stuff. Like, mine's flooded with RPGs, but that's nothing to be expected. Yeah. Yeah, I gotten into the old school again, but the, oh, there we see we have the. Save for training among friends, which is topped with elite dangerous. Okay. Yeah. yeah, I think we're good to go. I think uh, you need to get in and check. Fantasy everything. grounds for me. Warhammer and Borderlands. Are we gonna check again? Yeah. Resident it, it Evil seems Four. Like it, yeah, it seems like. Alright, so uh, let me. You, you need to reload your uh, art you put in your character because you couldn't find it. And I can see you loading in. <laughs> there you go, Kami. Yeah, you need to take your tax uh, stash, stash again. Like you, uh, stash. Okay. And then you need to re add the adventure and all just, that. Stuff. Just. just no, everything else is here. Here we are. So, this is the first crash I had in three years. Wow! I feel so honored! <laughs> it's like... <laughs> Part for like the course for me. Curse. Yeah, bacon curse. First actual D&D &D game in, in several years. And... and yeah. I'm not counting the stuff I'm doing with you, Spoon. That's a different system. And I'm not counting the Cthulhu stuff that we did, where I died horribly mm -hmm. yesterday. God, I'm still, I'm, I'm still a little salty about that. I don't, I don't blame you, Fluff. But, uh, yeah. Everybody dies in that game. Dude, but I'm telling you, that train link is way... Well, I, well it, again... It's, it's, it's very subtle. Yeah, you said, you said though, it wasn't really... I, I keep reminding myself that that wasn't the way you weren't supposed to find that out easily. But you have the... You, you can be lucky. Like, if you get if you get smart enough to get, like... Uh, you call oh, me stupid? Why does right? I'm not calling you stupid. I just say it's really hard to spot it. I mean, no, nobody has spotted it. Like, that's how subtle it is. Well, when something's that subtle, then that means like it's too subtle, in my opinion. Yeah. Like, if you're trying to if yeah. you're trying to put but, something but, out there, but then then again, you would have figured out the first day. If you, all that information you got uh, during those three days, you were trying to figure right, out. Right, but the thing is, like, what you. Sh 
if can I make a suggestion? If you if you don't want to hear it, yeah, then that's yeah. fine. Maybe make it so that something else comes along on the third day, that you know that is a little oh. more obvious. Uh, so that you know by that point, maybe that by you know by that point, uh, people can figure it out. Oh my my guy is gone. I got to reupload. Where's yeah. He... Fuck. There you are. There you are, Hanklist. You magnificent bastard. Oh, you're back where you are. Okay. And, uh... It, it's my map that crashed it again. Oh, it great. We gotta do the whole, um... No, no, we, no. We need the session again. Yep, our adventure list is empty again. He's gone. Yeah. Shit. But that is... Dead. Yeah, it's basically crashed, uh... Everything. Yeah. That's fine. So much for the cloud. As long as, long as it has a system to... To catch you, so it doesn't like delete everything. That yep. would suck. Then I would have rage quit immediately. They, oh, there you go. Now I have it. Everything is is as it should be. We're not playing Space Quest. We're not doing karaoke either. It's. You are in the dark cave. Let's change the All right, uh Can you uh, post your stuff again so we can put the? I can do that. Yeah. yeah. I will. You don't remember? It? Oh, wow. What? Oh yeah. Well, I, I could keep it up, but for the sake of the stream, I don't want to do that. <laughs> All right. So now we need to head DM. All right. See, that was the joke about Ex Adventure League. So. You have the 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 name of the adventure. No, we need we need all of it again. Okay, Unless, see. yeah, it's not. It's, I'll it's, get it. Just give me a sec here. Old Adventure League has like a number, and uh, that is that means basically D and D fifth season adventure one. Is what it means. You're in a dark. They cave. have they have a different campaign, different flavor each season. You're up to season seven now. This is from season one. Season five. Really? Okay. Yeah. Uh, uh, zero five, zero one. Here you go. There we go. So Thank it's Dungeons and Dragons so, Adventure League fifth the uh, fifth season. So we're editing adventure. and we're adding an adventure. We also yeah. lost the note for the uh, scrolls. I will also show you that. Here you go. And uh, okay, ooh. session is one. Date is 2018-02-10. GM name and DCI is none of your goddamn business. All right. What? What the hell? Uh oh. The hell? Something, something's still wrong here because. Oh, you pushed the. Okay. Uh, you see, there's a there's a lock on the right side. You need to open up the lock. No, that wasn't the problem. Okay, cool. Some t problem was when you pushed that thing, it actually kicked me out of the game for a second and put it me in Steam, which is weird. Cool. Okay. And that's your name. We're starting gold. XP is zero. Gold is zero. Downtime zero. Redown zero. Magic item zero. And now I'm gonna lock it. I don't make a mistake. Mm-hmm. Got that off, and now Nunder Notes. Is there any way you could force a save right now? Just in case this happens again? I have already saved it. I do it now. Okay, Luskin. Uh, you gotta get rid of You still got the Luskin note, by the way. Yeah, I would take it out away too. I'm gonna call this go. the uh, Session Notes. <coughs> session... Uh, okay. Uh, okay. As I said, you you came out to a cave, like a large cave that is lit. Okay, uh, led by Ulgrath and Henkless, you you enter that cave really slow and really careful. Also, and the what? party sheet's empty now. Yeah, I know that because I haven't put you in there yet. Yep. Right. You don't want that. All all the pictures is gone. That's weird. There we go. Okay. Sir. And uh, uh, what you see now in front of you is a large cavern. 
that is empty it seems to be empty of living any living creatures also there are several lanterns i will show you the map there are several lanterns that seems to provide light to the room that is put on the wall around this here area here yo Rogowski. Uh, you you can see right. there's like you can see there's you need to you're still blacking out there oh oh god sorry ah sorry <laughs> ah, there we go there we go sorry about that we're playing some fantasy grounds there are some dungeons and dragons actually sorry so uh what you see now as i said there's there are there's uh, rubble is piled up uh, several places up to at least like three feet of height like yeah. so it it could be that her information about it this area is unstable is right uh what you can see there are seems like it's it's two tunnels leading out in fact i will show you the uh, uh down at the bottom here down at the south end there is an exit here uh that will probably show itself right now so the northern part is a blocked off passage then there's a path to the south yeah uh there's there it seems like the the, the passage uh to to the e to the east there uh has uh has uh, collapsed basically uh also you can see there is something sticking out from the rock so you have you have a passage here okay and and you have a passage down way down here down in south but yeah. the, the cave is lit enough so you can see quite good you don't need a torch here right well, yep. we already dropped we put it. it out before we came into it so i'm gonna go it's take wrong. a look at that uh, that object uh, that caught our eye on the on the for the collapsed passage yeah just drag wherever you want oh. to go hey that's me Okay. Uh, as Go as you, so how you what is okay? Okay. As you get there, I I will uh, something happens, because you don't realize something, that there are rocks fall and I die. <laughs> three goblins hiding in the rubbles. Yeah. Uh, and, and you walk straight into their trap. They 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 smile at you, and then they say, uh, That's the fifth time this week. <laughs> <laughs> this is exactly the kind of thing that Hengless would do. Because, Ooh, look at because shiny. You're, because I you're you're so surprised. Six. Uh, <laughs> they've used a short bow on you, uh, Hengless. He will fire a short bow at you. The short bow misses Miss. uh, oh, just over the head. You hear the arrow like <laughs> breaks in on the uh, as it hits the wall. Uh, this uh, goblin number four, he will use his short bow also and fire on the blue blue drag dragonborn. And he, oh and he God! Crits. Jesus he Christ! That that means he gets two dice six plus two in damage. Oh! And that gives you <laughs> six points of damage. The sound effects. Ow! Yeah, that that I made those sound effects by the way. <laughs> That's awesome. Yeah. Uh, Story of my uh, life. Goblin, Going to combat. Goblin, goblin number Die. three. Charges you with uh, with a scimitar. Scimitar and right. uh, sh shout something in goblin. Uh, I forgot to fix my max. But you, you, you because Oosh. you will. Yeah, you, you have chosen a language. Do you speak my goblin? Languages? No. All right. Yeah, I don't. He says that in chat. Common draconic and dwarvish. Nobody understand what he's nice. saying. So, which one said uh, that? Uh, three. Then the number number three. Okay, so that that is the round. Now I want you to roll an initiative. I'm sorry, I don't speak, asshole. All right. Okay, initiative. You find Dang. that on your main tab. There's a button in the middle, in between AC and move, that in says, it. "In it." Yeah, you just roll. Why it did it once. roll two of them? Why do uh, you have a disadvantage? What? On your roll. Why do you have? Oh, your frighten effect. Shut. Shut up. Roll it over again. Excuse me? You had a frighten effect on your character. Oh, you were teaching... Uh, well, of course. <laughs> Fucking four. <laughs> this is, this has been the entire thing. Ooh. Okay, so we... You have... Uh, okay, so we go... If you open up your combat tracker, that will show your... Uh, the combat tracker is the one with the... Uh, 
Oh man, these freaking uh, maps. We did two swords. Yep. Swords. Yeah. So uh, I'm gonna start the second turn uh, just Same by as do, doing this. There we go. So Goblin Two is the one that is the first. Oh, one they basically had a surprise round. Yeah, they had a surprise on. Yeah, he will use his short bow and try to plug that. Uh, by the way, uh, Henkless, you see what is lying underneath that rubble? Mm. It's a pair of giant feet sticking out from the rubble. You mean like an actual giant's pair, a pair of Foot. giant feet? Yeah. He's, He's buried, buried on that. I saw footprints possibly came in here and yeah. died. Yeah. I, don't, I, 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 I think don't the goblins know. got him. Oh, bastards. And uh, the arrow hit you. Oh. Ow! And you get seven points of damage. Oh, shit. Jesus, that's is this, worse than the crit that hit me. Is this auto? That is auto or, damage. What are my hit points? You have See, one. You, you, you have no, one I have seven, that. dude. I have seven. No, you've taken seven damage. You have eight. Oh, yes. Holy you have shit! Eight. You're almost dying. Wow! We're off to a fun start. Yeah, oh, yeah. I told you. Wow, I guess maybe they changed things where level one is really horrible. Level one is always bad. <laughs> Not this Obeth, bad. It, it's your turn. Uh, you have four po hit points left. and You have damage, resist, shield. resist, lightning? And cool. Yeah, I don't know why I keep saying that. It, it I want to point that out, did I point out that I'm resistant to lightning? I just wanted to let you know. We take this it, opportunity. It is an effect. On, it's a permanent effect. How far apart means... are these lower two goblins? Uh, they are, uh, they are, the lower two is in cover, so you get a minus two to hit them. Hmm. But the one in front of you, he's... I uh... wouldn't need to hit him. I'm just no. questioning on how far they are from each other. As okay. in the distance between. Uh, so I don't know uh, how much the distance is in this okay. in squares. Okay, every square so is, is, is... Every square is five feet. So you can just count. So one, two, three, they are 25 uh, feet apart. Okay. It wasn't showing all the squares because I hadn't zoomed in enough. Okay. Cool. Yeah, it's gonna be too far for that Let's ability. Again. So, so, uh, uh, Ulgrath, if you hit the, down a display, display, hit it on display actions, then you get like your. Action. I'm on my actions. Okay. Let's see what do I. Want Take Doc. Do? Thanks for the auto host, sir. Well, situation's already pretty goddamn bad. So. Uh, well, that's what I get for. Blindly wandering in. Um, sorry, if I got us killed. <laughs> sorry. That was the shortest adventure ever. God, I hope not. Oh look, what's that over there? That didn't even give me a chance to do anything either. <laughs> yeah. No, you got you. You were so surprised because you basically, oh look, what's over there? It ran through over the cave and then just straight into a trap. Well, it was well. It was well lit. The cave and Bard went and said, hmm, "I'm gonna go poke this with a stick." Basically. <laughs> hey, I'm not the wisest person, and it shows. So Ulgrath, you, it's well, your, uh, it's your double turn. Double three. Yeah. I didn't like you. So you. Uh, uh, like kitty, you. Okay, so you cast <laughs> breath type. Nice. Okay. Uh, That's why I was one. trying to see the distances so I could see if I could line them up possibly. Uh, 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 then you see, you see you see in your actions there's uh there's like a two dice take yep. the first one that is that is a saving throw just drop it on him just grab it and drop Oops. it and drop it in the chat it. not on him sorry yeah oh, there you go no no on him on on the token on the yeah no you actually pull pull the action the and put it on the combat tracker yeah, okay. yeah. on the person you want to hit either the combat tracker or on the map on the, who you are going to hit i tried both and it just says cast yeah, wait. I will. I will put it in there. Combat there three. There you go. Okay, it says cast because it is just a cast. Okay, that's weird. Okay, it uh, should have a saving throw. It should. So let's see. The saving throw should be. Let's have a look. We I didn't can sa have... save properly. It looks like. Yeah, because it's different from character to character. I'm gonna put uh, uh, the save in there. Give me a sec. There Sorry, I didn't notice. We forgot to do that. Here we go, cast. Oh, there we go. We got the damage. We, there we got the cast. There we go. So uh, your save is DC for save is eight plus your constitution. Constitution. So plus two. And uh, so it should, oh, it it should say automatically. What the fuck? 
Why isn't it uh, showing you the right save? Plus com. On, oh, there you go. Uh, magic half on success. What the fuck? Weird. It's very strange. This, feel, uh, this feels very familiar, by the way. Fantasy Grounds is not working as intended. I don't know what it is about Fantasy Grounds and actual D&D. &D. Yes, I breathe lightning on myself. <laughs> <laughs> like, fuck this! Wait, I'm gonna put a add action. I'm add resistant. Did I mention I'm resistant to the lightning? Watch! <laughs> <laughs> yeah. It's basically a situation is already bet. And then you delete the ability. Mm. I'm gonna put it in right here. Dragon breath, breath weapon. Situation's bad. You guaranteed damage rather than chance to hit. There is the right oh, one. That's, that's a good one. idea. Uh, there you have it, the right one. That's black dragon. Yeah, it it shows the, all the damage from whatever you you have, but I'm gonna change change it to uh, blue. And that's also a die higher than it should that be. Is, that is wrong. Because that is dragon breath. <laughs> no, not dragon, uh, yeah. not dragon born breath. Yeah. Weapon. There we go. Surprise, I'm actually a dragon in disguise. I haven't made this script here, so it, it's not me that has. What the fuck? Why, why is it? Here we go, magic. Kind of surprised they didn't just make one for each type. They they uh, they did it originally, but it was really uh... oh now I know why it's not working because I have my fucking numlock on. There we go, traits. There we go, traits, and it to save his base um, plus eight. There we go. So guys, for those watching, I figured out, um, if you've ever played with a fidget cube, there's a spinny bit. I figured out a, a, a cheaper way of doing it, apparently. You can take a bottle cap and a quarter, and then just spin the quarter inside the bottle cap. And it, it has that same uh, feeling. Like you're working on a fidget cube. Okay, then. Sorry, he's figuring okay. things out, so I'm giving him yeah, time. Okay. And... So, so uh, I'm gonna roll it manually because there's something wrong here. Like this, it, it, yeah. But uh, okay, so he he's gonna do a eight plus Yukon. That is ten. Ten Does plus he get proficiency two. bonus as well, or no? No, he gets your proficiency bonus, so it's ten plus two. So he needs a uh, ten on his dexterity. So I'm gonna do a save throw, and he made the, he rolled a three. So you just drop that damage on him. Mm -hmm. What's the damage? Two D four. Yeah. Oh, two D four. Actually, you you basically you can see Fuck the the lightning uh, <laughs> goes through the body and he basically falls dead on the ground. Oh, g -g 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 and you can smell the smell of bacon in there. Oh. Oh. Why are you burning? <laughs> okay. <laughs> And movement. What are you moving? That's kind of what I'm deciding whether I'm going to just say fuck the human and out the cave. So now, now you have the option of moving if you want to. Yeah, that's what I'm figuring out. Oh, you want? You're gonna bail? All right. I'm thinking about it because uh, remember how the situation started. Mm -hmm. Walk in the room. I get shot with an arrow for a crit. You get shot. Almost go down. Good point. And I'm pretty but sure you... I'm faster than goblins. <laughs> well, you totally murderized that guy. Yeah, but I can only do that once per rest. Yeah, I'm, I, I'm looking at my little tricks right now. I think I have an idea what I want to do. What do you want to do, uh, Old Grath? Yeah, well, where do you want to find move? my speed and figure out? Yeah, you just you just speed that, is uh, that goblin. And by the way, the whole I monk know. thing. I don't think I have access to the increased speed from being a monkey. Should be speeds right next it's to your end in the center. So level two, you get it at level two. 
Yeah, so I'm at 30. So you got 30. You, what you do, drag your character, and I will show you how far you got. It will. Yeah, I'm just debating whether I want to book it or not. Because the situation already went bad. Yeah. And that guy, he got roasted because he would prevent me from running. Technically. Tax of opportunity and all that. Yeah. Um, you he lies there dead on the ground. Uh, basically, you he, he, you can see his, his his skin is boiling more or less. You basically fried his ass. Fuck that guy. Um, <laughs> dude, run. Yeah, I'm guessing you can make it out the cave as well because you'll have your both your actions. Move and a dash, mm. technically. Yeah, no, I have. Uh, if depending on uh, how things go, I, I might take yeah, another one of them. Roast him I'm noping out. Yeah. So Three, yeah, just four. drag your. Go there. That's twenty feet of it, and it won't let me move it for some reason. Yeah, just continue. Just drag where you're. At. I I will move okay. it as soon as you uh, get to where I can you get want. Up to there. And I will do this. Do. Okay, and that is your turn. Okay. I will. Then it's Hankless. Hankless. Uh, okay. Can I use the healing word on myself? Oh yeah. I can, and that's a bonus action, which is nice. So. That is a bonus action. So that is a free action, basically. You free can do action. One bonus. Yeah, I start you muttering can... to myself. I can't believe I freaking fell for this so again. So if you if you go to your action tab and hit. Yeah, no, I got uh, it. There you have healing then word. You just drop, then just just drop that cross on you. And it will heal you for four points. You see, down to. Wow, that was a shitty roll. You could heal. So you didn't heal because you didn't drop it on him. But I can do it like this, and there you go. There Thank you're down. you. <laughs> okay. So it's not as bad. That, that that is your bonus turn. Yeah, so no, I'm not done yet. I'm not done yet. I'm going to drop uh, dissonant whispers. On. Uh... <laughs> On uh on uh on with well, the guy that shot me. Where's Goblin Two? Which one's Goblin Two? This one, right? Or... Southernmost. Yeah. So are they so, both? So, are they both in cover? Well, it doesn't matter because it's an. But oh. before you do anything, because you use the spell, okay? So that mm. means you have to use a spell slot. So you need to click on the, on your spell slots. No, I didn't use the first. Oh yes, I did. Yes, you did. Okay. There you go. So you have one spell slot left. You can throw. But for for the first can, level, the cantrips don't yeah. matter. Yeah. Yeah. All right. So, so I, have, hmm. Do I? Yeah. Did, oh, okay. Now I got to think about it. Do I save it or do I just? No, I I do it. I I whispers, straight yeah. on that dude, on a goblin yeah. too. Yeah. So hold on. Yeah. Let me so it. so first you take the the first one that is the, his save throws. You just drop it on goblin. Oh, two sorry, sorry. Let me just put that somewhere over there. Okay. This is the just... saving throw, and then I'm gonna put it on which one's goblin two. No, like... no, not not damage. Not the damage. No, one. no, I know. Hold on. Yeah, do the save first. No, no I know. I there we go. Oh, this is so annoying. So he managed to save. Okay. And he ma managed to get a success, so he get half damage. Just drop the damage, and it will. And it will give him uh, half damage. There you go. <gasps> He's critically damaged. You, he, he made. You gave him six points of damage. Okay. That will take away the last of your spell slots, so you have to click. Yeah, on that. well, no, I'm out of my first, but that's all right. Yeah, got cantrips. Right. Yeah, I got cantrips, but nothing, nothing really. Well, I got something that might be useful to just give me advantage or give them disadvantage. I'm also running out of the cave. Yeah, you see now all your first level spell disappeared now from yeah. your action time. Okay, I, so I, I, and I'm here. I, oh god, hold on, not, I'm not done yet. Yeah. You can run 30, 30 feet. All right, and I'm behind that mound to kind of I'm yeah, give myself give some cover. cover. Yeah, yeah, that will give you some cover. Okay, uh, you hear that the Goblin Four? Uh, he uh, drops his weapon and shouts, "I give up! I give up!" Really? Okay, that's that's cool. And that's what he does this turn. And next turn, the other one say. "I give up too! I give up too!" They drop everything they have and they raise their arm. Nice. So uh, I didn't get to roleplay yeah. the. I didn't get to roleplay the spell. That was my fault. Sorry about that. Olgrath, it's your turn now. You can. Uh, you hear. The, you hear the sound of goblins. Uh, Mount up. Mount up. 
they shout out in common like, I give up, we, we are giving up. Oh no, don't kill us. I don't trust goblins. <laughs> <laughs> they don't have any weapons. They're just standing there. To to so be fair, what? yeah, I mean, they dropped their weapons after you 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 know barbecued one, and I basically migraine. I shouted at the other. Yeah, I gave the other one the migraine of the century. What what do you do? What do you? Like, do? I could call you to come back, but uh, yeah, I'm, 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 yeah. I'm guessing as soon as I hear that, I'll turn around and yeah, yeah. you you, oh, you they hear... dropped their weapons. Can't make it. To, oh, I can get behind there. I will go down to here. Just okay. Yeah. Uh, okay. Keeping an eye yeah. on them. Yeah. You run up to there and you see the guy behind over the mountain. You can see his hand sticking up, basically, <laughs> and you can hear him shout. I give up! Don't kill me! Don't kill me! I, 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 I come in peace. I, I'm sorry. I, it was a misunderstanding. <laughs> misunderstanding. Yes, it was. <laughs> misunderstanding. <laughs> um, Hi, gonna... It's your turn. You, you, on, you're behind cover, so... Going to hold action. You, if this yeah. one in front of me picks up or touches a weapon, I'm going to chuck a dart at him. Cool. That is good. That is what you're supposed to do. That's cool. Hold action. Okay. Right. Uh, Hanklish, it's your turn. You see that uh, Ulgras is readying himself to do something, but you don't know what. Right. He seems really doesn't trust those, those pesky goblins that just... They shot me with a fucking arrow. Yeah, yeah they, they shot. They nearly shot me dead. I'm actually pissed. I kind of, I kind of want to get. I want to. I kind of want to finish one of them. Uh, but I don't have my bow on me. I have my rapier. So, yeah, I'm just thinking. While they're giving up, you could technically go to the bottom one yeah. and have me deal with the one that's closest to me while you kill that one. No, I don't want to. I don't want to kill them though. I'm, I'm neutral good, so I'll hear them out. Where's I'm the cash? <laughs> and the other one, he shouts just, Don't kill me! Don't kill me! And then he walks out, like, slowly with his hand, and you see, like, like he's covering, trying to, like, be as small as possible, but he's, he's a small creature from before. Left I will his stop weapon behind. But, yeah, yeah, he left uh, his weapon behind. I will clear the initiative, and uh, we're out of rounds. Right, so uh, I, I uh, you can start moving your tokens freely. Uh, <laughs> the other, the other guy comes up and standing next to it. They're standing close to each other, like real. Oh, there you go, there you go. And uh, they try. He's bleeding badly. I mean, uh, you you hit him with that spell. Yeah, one good really turn hard. deserves another. Yeah, he coughs bloods and like trying but trying, but he's like really really nice. Like, oh, don't kill me. We we are. We are, we are, we are, we are, we are, we are friendly. I, 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 we thought we'd come here to kill. Yeah. <laughs> Tell us where the cash is. Tell us who else is in here, and then get out of my face. Uh, we don't know, but they, they, they both turn around and point towards the cave down, down there, and say, "Everybody went, went there, and we heard, I heard somebody screaming, and, 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 and the whole way there, they pointed at the, 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 where the giant feet, it fell down, the whole thing like collapsed on, on top of, on, on top of our master." Your but master? Uh, we, we don't know where, where, where the treasure is. We're here for the treasure, by the way. So you don't know either? No. How do you know about it? Uh, I don't know. We got, we had, we were forced to assist uh, two hill giants. They wanted us to help them finding the treasure. They have found the treasure map. Yeah, they are smart. Yes, they are. Oh, are both of them we... crushed or just one? Oh, just the one. I think the other one went with other boy, uh, with other other boys, and they left us here alone, facing facing you, mighty warriors. They're like, I'm I'm so sorry that I hit you with the arrow. I mean, I did I didn't mean to it. Why is it? I suppose we're even now. Now I wish I still had my dragon breath because I could just kill them both right now. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you for your information. <sighs> right. <laughs> Oh, neat. You want to see what else is neat? Right. What, what, can, 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 can we go, please? We will not bother you anymore. They, they, they I, look, I, look, I look over at the dragonborn and I said, what do you think? 
they look at the, their dead comrade like sitting there. You can even hear the crackling of his oh. skin like where you're standing. His he's, he's, bone marrow's popping. Yeah, yeah. The, 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 the small amount of fat he has on his body is basically melting. Ew. Ew. But it smelled nice though. It smells really nice, really. Cooked Compared perfection. to these other. <laughs> it smells like bacon. Mmm, bacon. That likes the bacon. What uh? What do you want to do? Please don't kill well, us. There's an arrow sticking please, out. Please, please, I, what do you think they, I want they, to do? They, they, they look at the uh, <laughs> look at the dragon person. We didn't mean to steal your treasure. What? We were forced to it. Oh, uh, steal. Uh, steal uh, 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 what are you talking uh, about? Uh, uh, isn't he a dragon? They point at the. Isn't you one of one of the dragon dragon cults people, that that were here before us? That well, uh, you, you, you want to feel this one? <laughs> hey, I I sit back and see. I I, I let the dragon speak because the dragonborn. Excuse me. The I'm dragonborn. honestly debating just stabbing this one with the arrow it shot at me. <laughs> yeah, yeah I believe arrow, this belongs arrow. to you. The Pretty arrow much. is still sticking out of your body. Like it hit you good. It it found like yeah, a, <laughs> one of your weak spots in your armor, basically, and buried itself in there. You, you it hurts when you breathe, <laughs> bastards. Mm. But 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 we gave up. We didn't we didn't hurt you because we knew you were so mighty and so powerful. The other one starts to uh, like standing there and standing. He 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 seems like he's. Losing conscience soon if you like he's really badly hurt. Please? We saw tracks, what look like oh, bear tracks. Uh, what uh, are uh, what is uh, that? The, 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 oh, 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 that is that is the bear with the one of the giants. Is that, they he went this way, bear? and they both of them pointing towards this cave here. And okay, they went oh, the whole the whole gang, but. We heard shouting, we heard screaming, something happened to them. We've been here for, for hours and they haven't showed up. So something bad has happened. And of course, our mighty leader got crushed in the, in the tunnel. They point at the feet on the guy. And uh, as you do that, you hear the, uh, the other guy just faints, like boom, falls over. I uh, bled out. Lies on the ground. Yeah, he bled out. Hmm. And Neat. the other one is, is like, oh no, oh no. Please, well, please. That, that one was mine. That. What? I said, well, pity that. Uh, yeah. Oh, help my, help my. No, no, don't help him. Help me. I, I want to get. Can, can I let go? No. You can have him. You can kill him if you want to. As I'm a revenge. Going it to... was him. It, it was him who, who shot the arrow on you. Uh, Actually, you no. The one that dropped was the one that shot the arrow on me. Just um, to... My own arm's okay. gone from my actions list, by the way. Yeah, uh, I will put it in because I need to get the right one. Just give me a sec here. Uh, you're going to lay him out, aren't you? Ooh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Honestly, yeah, just, you know, if anything, just for the just for the you know the, the ensuing uh, silence would be nice. That's kind of the idea. Uh, uh, <laughs> Shut either, up already. You can't he's, go around to another entrance and get more he, he, or he, more from outside. He, he's really whining and annoying. Yeah, no, I, I, I you, you, you've definitely uh, um, um, evoked that, dude. Don't, don't worry about it. <laughs> yeah. By now. He's, I'm By just. Now. You sound like two Roger Rabbits. Oh, please, Eddie. I can't. To... I, 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 oh, I can't do it. Me. Please don't kill me. Attack for him. Um, 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 Shut him up, if nothing else. Oh yeah, please, just, just. Stop. So I'm guessing roll. Yeah, we need staff, an evoking mode. What's up, Laser? Welcome to D and D. Bonus action. Are you working, sir? So hit him with the quarter staff since it's a flexible weapon or whatever the heck that effect yeah, you, is. Yeah, you like can hit him, and uh, because because he's he doesn't think yeah, that do you're do you. gonna hurt him, you can get an advantage die. That means you see it down on the left there. It says add this. Click that once. Yeah, just click it once. It's turned red, and then just drop the the, the attack dice on 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 the goblin number four, because uh, the other one is dying, bleeding. Out. Wow, and you missed when he was not resisting. You managed to miss, and he starts <laughs> to wail, wail like a like a kid, and then he starts to run. 
Well, then I get an attack of and opportunity both, as well. Yeah, bo both both of you can but get an attack of opportunity. That, I still have my bonus action for the unarmed. Sure, the yeah. rapier. I'm, I'm not letting yeah. him uh, give away. <laughs> that is a hit, so you drop the damage die on him. So that is four points of damage. And then you drop... Oh, that is, is there is there a lethal, lethal and non-lethal anymore? 1d4 plus 1. That shouldn't... It plus 3, you should be. No, yeah, it's so plus it's... 1. No, plus, uh, plus 3. Yeah, I will change that. I will give him two more points of damage. So is he's that... basically dead. No, he's still at one point left. And then the attack of opportunity. <laughs> and then you can do the attack opportunity. Oh, me, right? Or, or wait, you attacked him and you have an attack of opportunity? I'm confused. He started running. He can no, I get it, but, but I thought that was your AOO attack, the 14 mm -hmm. plus 4. He can do two attacks in the, in the turn. He, can, he d used his staff, and then he used... Uh... Oh, nice. Yeah. I'm guessing I have to use the staff for the attack of opportunity, and wait. Shouldn't the quarter staff have been plus 3 as well? Yes, it is. Quarter staff uses dex? Yeah. Uh, yeah, because... No, uh, only your unarmed one. Nope. Check the ability. You can also build weapon, it monk weapons. Oh, cool. What do you get? Would you get weapon finesse? No, he has a monk finesse. He's a monk. Monks. Oh, that? that's right. That's okay. I haven't played a fifth For edition. Attack monk. and damage rolls of your unarmed and monk weapons. Yeah. Nice. So you you get yours based so on dex. Okay. There we go. Now it should Two change. Points. And your uh, unarmed should also change. I will give it there oh. and and the there. Staff. There we go. Now it should be plus two plus two. One nice two. plus two because your dex yeah. gives you a plus two bonus. There you go. So attack of opportunity if you want to roll your yeah, attack. Yeah, yeah. Well. You you can roll first and then Heinklis can roll his attack of opportunity. Want to? <laughs> and you <laughs> fail <laughs> miserably. What the fuck? I apparently suck with the staff. <laughs> yeah. And uh, Heinklis, you can drop your uh, attack roll on him. Okay, and that is going to be. Rape. Why does it say? Rape? I have all this stuff equipped. No, that can't be right. That you have t one dagger, one club, and a rapier. Welcome to Dungeon and Dragons. H no, haven't I'm... you seen a Dungeon and Dragons character? They have like yes, but usually weapon. you only have like one weapon equipped at one time. Am I walking around with all the like? I can just yeah. pull this like for as They're a free action. Your wrists. Yeah, you, it it doesn't <laughs> to put to draw a weapon is doesn't cost an action. You can basically pull and attack a weapon at the same time. Not like All before, right. you have to do a draw. To All right, him. I flash with my uh, flash with my rapier because yeah. he's trying to yeah. run. Yeah, uh, that would help if I. Yeah, he but did. That, that was a critical hit. Wow. So yeah, he tried to run. I just went and I lunged. Then you, drop, then you drop the damage on the on him. Okay, and this is four. Yeah, he's the only one left, right? Yeah. All right. Sorry, getting used to this. Yeah, and. Uh, He's basically you shove the rapier through his eyeball and basically comes out the other end and he dies instantly. He did try to run. Just want to say did. he did. But then again, somebody attacked him like unprovoked. But that is he's a goblin though. It is a goblin. It's no, a good uh, goblin's a dead it, goblin. Yeah, it's it's it's. Well, uh, <laughs> I guess I, I guess I'm a too hippy dippy for that. But I was like, oh, they stopped fighting. I can't kill him now. But he was running, and, and he might have <laughs> alerted the others, so. So you're lying there. He ble he, he, yeah, yeah, he dies dead. instantly. You pierce his brain, basically, and he's he lying oh, nice. dead. I'm going to go oh. stomp on the neck of the one that was bleeding out just to make sure it's dead. Yeah, you crush his skull, basically, by stomping on oh. it. You... Now, search you're, the bodies. You're brutal. you're brutal. Oh, yeah, they, you find something, in fact. On them that is can be very useful uh maybe for you a guys bow. no uh <laughs> you find um oh, that's right i don't have a bow that's no, kind of what i meant you don't. <laughs> well you, you found uh there. you found two bottle of alchemist fire i will drop it in the party sheet for you uh alchemist fire there we go I'll drop it in the party sheet. There we go. One and then two. Okay. Anything else? Nope. That is, uh, except there uh, you find like a scimitar of uh, poor quality and a uh, short bar of quality and those pesky arrows also. Sure. Something bro, else you might want. Something's... 
Nothing you, else. If something's poor quality, what does that mean? It's like minus one to hit, minus one damage? No, it, it, it's just your... It has nothing to do if it's poor quality. Good quality, though, is will give you bonuses. But poor quality is normal weapons. I take one but of the short bows and, and uh, half the arrows, I guess. Unless you, you, sure. you want... I, I, not over him. You want the other short bow? No. No? Yeah. It is it, it is a short bow of uh, goblin make, so it looks like it's made by, uh, out of goblins. But I'm dropping it in your inventory. The short bow. Short bow. There you go. There Plus, you go. How many arrows? No, I guess I take all the arrows. Yeah. Yeah. No. So you. Please. Yeah, you can. Well, you ha you can fit twenty in one of those. All right, so uh, I take twenty. Short bow plus twenty yeah. arrows. Yeah. So just if you go to your action tab, you can give yourself. 20 ammunition just write 20 in there i will do it for you there you go thank you so every time you you use though it, it will take off one of those arrows until you run out of ammunition okay so uh yeah so uh well it's it one relief except you basically basically butchering those goblins is that uh, they it's now quiet again no whining <sighs> nothing else Anything we can salvage from the uh, giant that's partially sticking uh, out? Yeah, well, you can see it's been crushed of of the rubbles, basically. Um, uh, can next... I can I interrupt for a second? The other short bow is it worth any money? Should we take it with us, or it doesn't work like that in fifth edition? No, it doesn't work like that. Okay, so it's something I can use. Otherwise, no one would pay me money for it. Okay, got it. No, nobody wants to buy it, or except if they have some fetish for orc or a goblin. Goblin gear. All right. Thank yeah, you. Basically, better than nothing, but not gonna make you any money. No. Also, by both of you are quite hurt. By yeah. by by that. Yeah. Uh, and by the way, welcome to Dungeons and Dragons again. <laughs> Level one combat. It's bad. <laughs> it is, it is yeah. bad. Wow. Uh, yeah, I was like, I'm gonna hold on to my good stuff, and I'm like, no, that motherfucker nearly killed me. So. Mm -hmm. I, I, yeah, that's a cool spell. I love that thing. The dissonant voices. I bet that's something new to fifth edition. It looks like, or maybe. Yeah, there's a lot of new, like vicious mockeries. Yeah, no, I was like, oh, that sounds awesome. That's perfect. <laughs> your mother was a hamster, and your father smelled of elderberries. Yeah, just freaking insult <laughs> people. <laughs> okay, so uh, I hunting giant. Say again. Said we may be a little unprepared for hunting giant. Well, let let us rest then. I just mean a general. You choose to be a general? What? I said I mean in general. Oh. Uh... I don't know the two, or if the two of us are going to be enough to take a giant You, you have the option of doing a long rest or a short rest. A short rest is one hour rest. But, but you don't get again, your spells back. No, I won't uh, get you spells uh, well, back. Well, breath back some it would give you some something back but what you can do is if you see on your main tab there's a hit die on your main tab on your character that means you can roll that to gain that m amount of hit points back and for every level you get a new hit dice and with a long rest you get half of it back just automatically half your hit points back yeah yeah so you have the option but then again you're in a cave and you know there is a group of goblins and there's possibly a giant and also a bear maybe we should leave the cave and try and find a place to rest uh, out in the path or it's just not a good spot there's no there's no good spot for a long rest it's it's your decision you're you're the adventures here we're probably gonna well i'm, I'm talking to i'm talking to spoon now uh yeah if we can't find a, a safe spot then maybe we just need to deal with a short rest or we need to go back to town and try and come back here but the treasure might be gone by the time we come back. So yeah, exactly. short rest would be town. Good, town will take you at least four days to reach the to reach Wait. Panast. Yeah, what would you say, Spoon? Short rest will be good because you get your breath. Short back? rest would probably be good because if nothing else, at least I can roast another one with lightning. Oh wait, you hear something? You hear a scurrying sound? Oh god, coming from where? From here, like like. Uh, also, you hear like high pitch sound, uh, like yeah. Like uh, a lot of like uh, squeaky, high pitch echoing. I turn. I turn. No. The, I turn the 
the dragon. Uh, it's, those rats? it's very. It, it seems like it's emanating from the mouth of the cave that the south came here, and it seems to get louder and louder. Remember, they said something attacked the, that that party. Maybe we should get out of this cave. Probably a good idea. All right, exiting the cave very yeah. quickly. Okay, <laughs> cool. You get out, you run out, and it seems to get dark, so you need to probably pull out your torch. Yeah. And you get out uh, to the... To, behind you, you can hear that uh, weird sound is following you. No joy. Oh, okay. And... Uh, and uh, yeah, let's make our way out, out you, of the mouth of the cave if we can. Yep. And you get out on... On the, on, oh shit. Before we actually exit the cave, going to yell as loudly as I can in Draconic into the cave, try and cause a collapse or something, or at least freak them the hell out. <laughs> Alright, so I'm, I'm bleeding this little exit and you're you're trailing and you turn around and you do that. Cool. Mm -hmm. Hey, you said it was unstable. Yeah, it, it's shown size of... Uh... Signs of being unstable. You are in the mountains. <laughs> You're in the mountains. You get out. I just meant at the mouth of the cave to do that. Oh, and, so you did uh, that from there, or you did that from the 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 entrance outside? The exit. Okay, the exit. <laughs> All right. Not gonna do and, that one in the cave. You get out. You feel the smell of of fresh air again hitting you, and it's it's. But behind you, you can hear that squeaky sound, like following you from the. No from reaction the to the yelling in Draconic at all. Uh, not really. Except the squeaking house is getting like more and more like rah, 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 rah. more. It's um... Probably bats, not rats. Now that I think about it. What? You don't know. Well, uh, yeah. Well, we're not standing in the cave to find out. So uh, uh, you, you, back away from the mouth of the cave and uh, you know and give hide somewhere. Exit and off to the side. Yep. Yeah. 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 Uh, do a uh, stealth roll. Please. Oh, you know, we're great at that. <laughs> yeah. You're really dun, good at dun, it. Dun, 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 dun. Actually, I dun. should be good at that with a plus three, but whatever. I got a plus dun, two, dun, but I'm not skilled in it. Hey! Oh, so over ten! Yeah, that's a good one. That's a good one. Now to see how well this goes for me. I'm guessing like a one or two. Eight! Uh, not the that best. That is uh, not very great, but you you tried to hide behind some rocks not far from the entrance of the cave and do you have a tail you, is your tail sticking you, out you see after a while tail. you, you see something really point. strange uh, uh appearing you see a large group of tiny tiny goblins i mean really small at least uh runs out of the cave they have are uh, they have like tiny tiny uh scimitars tiny tiny uh Short bows. Yeah, short pause. They're at least like maybe 50, 60. They're running like, and they're running out of the cave, and then they they turn uh, to your left of you and runs away from the entrance and disappears into. Uh, I think that was odd. The yeah, that was hell. very strange. Like shrunk goblins. Yeah, they're, time? They're, they're probably like yeah. I think we know what happened at the raiding party over there. What three the inches, hell? three three inches high, probably like. Yeah, roughly Snack like size. three inches. Yeah. No, Bite-sized goblins. Bite That's weird. Well, apparently they smell like bacon, so they might be delicious. I doubt Ooh. that. No, no. And you can hear them disappear, and the sound disappear behind them. Like, blah, 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 blah. Anything my we can at? make out from what they're saying? No, no. Uh, they're they shout, they, they're they shout the goblin. They're speaking in goblin? Yeah, and it was so like it was more like high pitched. Was there sound. was there like a taller like you know like a six inch uh, or no. like a nine inch uh, giant or something like that? You saw only you saw only, only the goblins, only the goblins. Yes. So that means there's still the giant and the bear. Hmm. All right. Yep. We can take them. What do you say? You want to head back in before we do? Yeah. Yeah. Rest. Good idea. Okay, so we do, we do a short rest. Okay, short, rest. short or long is the question. You get your spells back on the long. Yeah, but heal. but it's 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 a nine hour rest. Yeah, thing. I don't think that's gonna yeah. work out for this. It looks like we're in a race no. against time. So then it will turn dark and. Uh, so but, let's yeah. do a short rest. Okay. okay. And then you can do uh hit your yep. roll your hit die. Oh yeah, baby. Yeah. 
And there you go. That's a good time. I got you, eight back. You, wow, how do you get? You get plus two? Nice. Con. Oh, all right. Con. I don't con. All right, so we're basically full up again. Nice. Uh, almost. I am. Well, he, he might After be, a short know. rest, you feel good. Uh, really good. I mean, uh, uh, you get your dragon uh, breath back. At the this is a cantrip again, by the way. Yeah, no, I will change it. Here we go. I feel good. I knew that I would. Trying to fix it, I take it. So good. It's funny that that so doesn't. Good. I feel good. Sorry. It's weird. Mm -hmm. yeah, and while change. you guys are figuring that out just to let you know I have to start my shift in uh, 45 minutes so yeah, if you want to keep going I can go for a while uh, but uh, just uh, yeah, that's on you no I'm fine I'm fine with going on I'm just saying that I'm going to have to stop in 45 minutes is there going to be a point we can break off if we go in yeah. so yes or no I think we should go in and find out what we did was get our asses kicked by zombies. Uh, zombies. Goblins for like five seconds. Uh, was there any sort of count that we could get on the three inch tall ones that went by or just. He said oh, there were probably. Uh, there was so. Like, like, imagine like maybe 50, 60 goblins. Like, so it looked like a moving goblin. carpet, basically. Yeah. My picture is gone. Basically, a swarm, a tiny swarm. They're not uh, larger than mice, basically. They were they were like really tiny. Then that's all the goblins that we saw tracks. Because oh. he said forty to fifty. We killed. I thought, three I, thought I, 50 I didn't know what I was talking about though. I mean, that's out of character. Mm -hmm. Thought I was talking out my ass. I guess it really was fifty or sixty guys. It was. Right. Though did those? I don't think we checked if the tracks led here from the uh, dead contact. Nope. No, but putting two and two together, they they were they had the treasure map. They knew about this place, and it sounds like they were hired by somebody. Yeah. Which we didn't get that information before you decided. You know, if you wanted to shut them up. <laughs> I was tired of listening to it. <laughs> okay, okay. So back into the cave. Yep. What do you? Oh, oh I, I, that is my. Uh, I think I'd like to do that. What about you? Yeah, I'm fine with that. Yeah, I wasn't. I wasn't Head dictating back in. for both Being of us. more uh, careful this time. <laughs> yeah, I think uh, the the arrow in uh, my side. Uh, okay, definitely. so you head in again, like uh, yeah, stealthy we, again. Yeah, do a stealth roll and see how good you are. Let's see if I just go stomping through again. Like bam bam. Oh hey, not bad. Oh. <laughs> that is a that is an automatic fail. Bum, bum, so that is that bum, is really bum. bad. You come with your own theme music. You're sneaky, and my character's heavy as hell and stepping on rocks. So yeah, you're like cr crushing all the rocks underneath your talons. I'm serious about the heavy as hell part. I rolled for his weight when I was doing the write up based off the uh, information. Where did it end up? We got like 300 pounds. 327. Shit. He's six foot ten. Oh my god. <laughs> All that stuff's rolling on it on their table. Freaking huge guy. Okay, you get into the cave again. Right. Again, you have the torch that leads you a little, and then you uh, shut on the, the torch. And this time, uh, Hanklis, even you realize that Ulgrath doesn't. Don't, his stealth skill is shit. I'm just shaking my head. I'm just shaking my head. It's like, like it's 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 what? to the borderline embarrassing. Nothing, right? nothing, Let's nothing. Uh, but Let's press on. I don't know how 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 um. I used to sneaking in caves. Like you are. I will give you the. Me? Here you go. Or traveling. Oh, I'm like I'm like a uh, six feet. Sound? One one. The cave. One eighty. What is it? What 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 is you average? There, guys? What is average for somebody yeah, who's six too? feet? I have no idea. I'm not sure. Did I lose you? Oh, hello. I can hear you. Okay. Hold on. Can you hear me? To the... He can't hear Discord us. Discord went retard. Fluffy, he's in the he's in the wrong chat. That's why. There you go. Okay. You moved yourself to general for some reason. No, I had to do that. It's sometimes uh, when uh, I drop yeah. out, or you Discord can acting up. Yeah, it's Discord's weird. Discord's being a little bitch. So you. 
you enter the cave again and you see the dead goblins lying there uh, spread eagle like they did as you leave them the light is still on and you see the dead giant lying there just a question you... what's what's uh what are the lights just standard lanterns or there are torches? looks like there are, are oil lamps basically like the mining lamps you can find in 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 mines <coughs> Can and I salvage uh, one? As in pull uh, one down? Not really, because they're not very useful, really, in, uh, except uh, having heavy, on, on the wall. Heavy and unwieldy. Yeah, it's 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 figured, but it's had to not. Ask. Yeah. What is it? But uh, then again, you, well, you see the lights go all the way down to the south tunnel. That is the only tunnel you haven't mm. checked out yet. You mm. move slowly this time. Uh, Guess so we don't see anything watching the here. Watching the rubble, and it, so there's no sneaky goblins hiding, and mm. it seems safe yes. where you are at. It looks like Hank Hankless is a little bit uh, hanging back a little bit, watching what you are doing. Oh, he's the one that made all the noise. They didn't see me yet. Yeah. <laughs> Clunk, clunk, clunk. You can hear you as uh, every footsteps like uh, clang, uh, clang, 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 clang. In, inside the cave. You, 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 you're your your shit, basically. <laughs> One is is a is a critical uh, failure. Yeah. yeah, back if it were like three point five, you would have really fucked it up. But uh, fumbles. Yeah, here is here is just a automatic failure. It doesn't matter. Four ones in a row testing my system. I know. And throwing his knife out of freaking window. Oh, that was hysterical. Sad, but I mean, it was it was a cool knife. So it's like, how so did you do that? So, so what are you doing now? Are you gonna continue down going south? To, uh, yeah, around about here. Yeah, I'm I'm hugging the wall. Yeah, Just, and I I'm yeah, basically I'm over. following the tank. Okay, cool. So uh, uh, he's making all the noise anyway. So, okay. actually, I I hang back about like ten feet behind him. Okay. Yeah, you don't see anything. Uh... Head around this corner, then. Yeah. Boom. Boom. You, Boom. you see the tunnel ahead of, in front of you is dark. Joy. Okay. Oh, so you made it all the way down already, or, or it's just the second yeah, half you, of the short? Head over yeah, you... here to look into this yeah. little alcove yeah. over here, see if there's anything yeah. in there. No, you don't see anything uh, uh, particular. You still have your tour trap? Did you put it away? I would put it out, and then I'm guessing I lit it when we came back through that little hallway since it's dark, and put it back out again, trying to conserve yeah. it. Yeah. Hmm. So, yeah. You, you, <laughs> you, I don't know how long torches burn in this. I don't know. Do they say on our inventory? Why am I around? Oh God. Can you hear the sound on the? Uh, no. But the key. Okay. Uh, just give me a sec here. Uh, it doesn't say a duration. Oh, wait, there we go. It burns for one hour. Why do I have a circle around me? Oh, because I'm, I'm stealthy? No, because you're selected. Oh, never mind. Okay, I hear something now, like a low rumble. Yeah. yeah. Cool. Okay. Perhaps um... the screaming was a bad idea. <laughs> <laughs> uh... Uh, if you're going to continue into the, that tunnel, you need to light the torch. Will you yep. will not able to see anything? It's just mostly, have I actually consumed one by now? No, no like, man. It's only, been no, like, no. it's only been like 10 minutes. Yeah. You At haven't least it feels consumed like anyway. any. And I will go down to about here and light a torch. Okay. And you see that the, the, the tunnel continues inward. And uh, yeah, and it seems to turn to the east, but you see okay. nothing. It, but the light is good. I mean, you now you can actually see any large footprints heading down. Uh, yes, and you can see there are also a bunch of tiny footprints. And uh, yeah, there's basically a mix of goblin and uh, hill giants and and a bear. also a bear. Goblins and hill giants and bears. Hill Giants is the problem. <laughs> we can take up... No, famous last words. 
down here. Sounded like a good idea at the time. Uh, okay, you you can see as you can see on the map, uh, it will light up a little bit more, uh, and you can see some. It starts to get a little bit lighter. Oh, in uh, uh, it seems like there's some sort of light source ahead, okay. but it's very faint. You still need a torch a little bit longer. Go to about here then. Okay, then uh, then you see there's a. Uh, it opens up to a, like a tiny cave, but it's basically the, the it it basically swings to the left, and f from there you can see there is actually some sort of light, so you don't okay. need a torch anymore. No, my torch again. Again. And then you turn into shadows. I am the terror that cracks in the night. And uh, you, you're the no, quiet. You can, yeah, well. yeah, yeah, yeah. See if you there's can, anything up that cave. Uh, so you're sure. gonna sneak ahead. So, so the... no, he's telling me to go sneak ahead. Okay. I'm asking him since he's the quiet one. Yeah. All right. Like, so ask, ask I go to yeah. here, being stealthy still. Roll the stealth roll, please. A new one. A trip on a rock. Ugh. <laughs> Ten. Not the greatest. Still okay. Been, my stealth rolls have been. Uh, you get to the corner, around the corner. <laughs> and a giant and, head uh, just reaches out. And, and you see there's a... The, it, it, when you turn your head around the corner, you see there's a there's a cave opening up in front of you. Okay. And... Uh, oh, shit. So yeah, I guess this is where I am. The over here. Just out of sight. You just peek your, uh, across the corner, and uh, what you see in, in, in front... Of uh, of this cavern area, uh, it will appear soon. Just give me some seconds here to make it work. No problem. Uh, there you go. You see, there's a uh, there's um cavern here mm -hmm. that is probably the last cavern in this small cave here. It's lit with lanterns throughout. Uh, to the north, at the far end of the corridor, you can see there's a small creature that is dressed in a f ratty furs and he's wielding a club. He stands in front of a, a, a stone chest that is even with his eyes. You, his back is to you, and you can catch the sound of some angry rumbling coming from his direction, but it's way too faint to hear it clearly. Okay, but he looks like he's dressed like a hill giant, doesn't he? Yes, but right. it's like yeah, uh, he, he looks fall like a hill. I fall back. Looks like a few a, feet. It looks like a, a hill giant in stature, but no, in in in. Right, looks... he's a miniaturized hill yeah. giant. He he, whatever happened to them happened to him too. So yay. About how? So, oh, since I can't see it, I can't ask. Yeah, no, no. I fall yeah. back and I, I motion him over and you I say, fall. "It looks like yeah. the giants suffered the same fate as those goblins." I'm you whispering this. See yeah, you can barely see a regret in the in the in the shadows because it's so dark. All right, where you're at. How tall was he now? Uh, he came as tall as the chest that he was looking at, and he looked pretty pissed it's about like it. It's like the size of a goblin. Yeah. So maybe three feet. Any sign of the bear? No, I didn't see any sign of the bear. Do I see the bear? No, I don't. No, I you see haven't the bear. seen any sign of bear. So that that could still be an issue, but uh. We should probably go in before he uh, figure before whatever happens wears off. If we're gonna get to that treasure, lead them back to this hall. I roast them both at once. Okie doke. Let's do that then. Now I'm walking loud and proud up to here. Yeah. Or actually, no, no, no. I, I still, I stealthily go back up to here, keeping an okay. eye out for the bear so I don't get jumped. As you go up there, uh, you hear there's a yelp coming from your left, like a yappy growl. That, mm -hmm. and uh, as soon as you uh, you see there's a, a tiny bear like standing. Oh wait, you stood there. I'll give you there. I love the token. Get a bad feeling yeah. he's going to get like, killed by like, a gopher-sized like, bear. Uh, it seems <laughs> it lurks the creature funny. in front of you. The creature in front of you turns around. And uh, he and he shrieks in fury. I slay mighty the giant will tear you apart and feed you the blood drinker. And then he charged. Him. <laughs> I burst out laughing at him. Yeah. <laughs> Are you kidding me? 
very, 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 he doesn't look very, very like a very. He, he, as I said, he's the size of a goblin. Okay, yeah, bring it, short initiative. pants. Roll initiative. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> and didn't actually roll it, did it? Nope. I got it. Nope. Put it on the. Wait. There you go. Seven is my favorite number. Oh, so, wow, uh, it's your favorite Hank number too. Hankless, <laughs> you're you are first. You can do what do you, uh, you want to do? You see that? You see that uh, tiny like he's coming. Ah, uh, die, die. Um, yeah. Um, the mighty, I take oh, out my. Oh, yeah, I take out my rapier. Actually, he's tiny, yeah. so I'm like, well, doesn't make he's sense. He's also a ways away. You can technically shoot him and run, or cast a cantrip. I don't want to Spartan's kid, though. I only get two, and uh, that's not really going to help here. I mean, I could give him disadvantage, but that's like yeah. a standard action, right? Uh, uh, spells should be a standard action. It's just yeah, cantrips you can use over and over. Yeah, yeah cantrips can and... use over and all over right, All right, again. so no, I don't need to do that yet. Um, what I am going to do is I'm going to... Where's the bear? Do I see the bear? No, but you hear... You hear there's some sort of... Uh, Sound emanating because of the because of the stone on the left. It's beyond that stone. It's like a it's like a. <laughs> okay. <laughs> like a All right, you know what? Shorpo on the goblin giant, and I'm yeah. gonna fall back. So I'm gonna shoot him. Yeah. Do do the shot first. That seems to not hit him at all because you're not dropping the. But I will drop the attack on him. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I forgot about the combat tracker. And, and, and it hits. You can drop it in on his icon on the map also. You don't have to drop it on combat. Tracker. Oh, all right. So let's do this. So that is a hit. You, but the arrow finds the target. So you drop the oh, damage God. on him. There's so many. Hold on. So annoying. Uh... Right here, yeah? Yeah. Yeah. Just tri Wow, that Ooh. was awful. That was five points of damage. Okay. Uh, so that is that is quite good. Okay. And you can now. I'm move falling to... back. I'm falling back to. Uh, yeah. I'm gonna follow the plan just in case he decides yeah. to enlarge. Yeah. And begin whatever you fucking want to call it. Yeah. And I'm uh, moving here. Come get me. Yeah. Okay. Just remember, it's a direct uh, line, so. No, no. I well, I, that's my maximum speed. Yeah. That is what he so, can... I mean, if you want to wait, if you want to no, wait... you're referring can... to the breath. Olgrad, <sighs> it's your turn. No, well, you see there's that little... There's this little spot over here. Like, yeah. here. I'm, I'm not... I'm, yeah, there's a spot over here that, uh... Um, you know. Ignore that movement. I was just yeah, trying to show him the spot. No, you, uh, I'm guessing you're trying you, to head if, there so I can get If you hold down you. both right. your mouse, mouse buttons, uh, Bacon, you can draw an arrow. See here? Whee. Okay. He's over this way. Distance. For some reason, I can see the bear's token. So, yeah, he's there. I I put him there just now. Just what? To show. Him. All right, can I get I can rid of that arrow? Well. Oh God. Yeah, but just by double. Oh, that, uh, just by dragging, uh, clicking on your character again, like that. Okay. <laughs> uh, so Sorry. But I'm going to but the go. arrow to get the arrow is hold down both mouse button and. I did. I did. I hold down both buttons and I. But that. Uh, there you go. I'm going wow. to go there. Okay. Yeah. How do I get rid of it? But by, by clicking both. Just and clicking. Again, I can't one. hold the last bit of my movement to move where. Yeah. Hanklist is, if he moves out of that spot. Oh, you know. Oh, well. Like, you can still five move five. You still have five feet left to move. So. Who me or him? You Stay, get in front of me, dude. If you want. If you want yeah, to breathe, get in front of me. Yeah. Yeah. Go there. And hold action. Okay. Uh, what uh, you gonna? What what is gonna trigger your action? If the giant gets within range, I'm okay. Roasting him. Cool. Well, midget giant. Not <laughs> super scared of a freaking. It is a miniaturized giant space hamster. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Not so scared of Boo. Go for the eyes, Boo. Go for the eyes. More worried about <laughs> giant. Yeah. Uh, that's mm -hmm. great. Ending. Uh, that's the end of his turn. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and, uh, and you can. Uh, uh, well, I can do it. But there's a button on the left side that will. Uh, Slayer Mighty. 
So Slayer Mighty, the the Hill Giant. giant. He, he is really mad. He's wielding his club and shout is You can die! Die die <laughs> And uh, runs towards you. And he will get his he only have twenty feet to move, so he, he's gonna dash, so he's getting there. That means you're in range. Yep. Triggered. So I will do the saving throw first because I haven't made the. Uh, I just put in, in uh, oh, there. We get traits. Still working on fixing it. All that. Yeah. I'm gonna do it when uh, when we're done here because it's it's a script error. I'm gonna. There we go. And <laughs> I keep getting an error sound whenever the whole. Remember, I'm a resistant to lightning thing pops up. Yeah. Why is it saying it's country? Because it's not. It is a, it's ability. There we go. Oh, wow. Because you didn't capitalize the trait. There we go. And, yeah. There you go. Okay. Uh, okay. Uh, I'll do a saving throw. It's still 12. I need to, to make the save. So I will do the saving throw for Mighty because the... Curse to me, he's shrunken, but he probably has the same amount of hit points as he did when he was bigger. It's probably less dangerous. Well, he won't do as much damage because of his size, but I'm wondering if he retains his toughness. Regardless, good point. Uh, good, uh, good move, barbecuing him. Hmm, weird. Okay, uh, I'll do the saving throw for him, and uh, Slayer Might is gonna get uh, the deck save of. He saved. Seventeen. So yeah. Half damage. So, uh, half damage. Just just drop the, the the damage in in the chat. I will half it and dro pull, uh, drop it on him. So that is Ooh. four. I will half that. Four roll. So I will drop that Static as a damage. Static electricity. Oh, shame. So that is that is his damage, and uh, Slayer Might is done. And you're done, and uh, it's now Henkley's turn again. Bear not doing anything? Bear is not doing anything except, uh, well, you can't I see I can't see the bear. Yeah. All right, so I, I move. I just figured I, it would have made it to us by now. Out of the way, let me try and finish this. And I move past them 10 feet. Yeah, that is basically, when you move through a people, that is double move, so that is 15 feet, really. Well, that's fine. Like, hold yeah. on a second. I, I ready my bow. I shoot him, and yeah, good shot. Yeah. And a miss. And that is a miss. And you can still move. Finish your move if you want to. Hmm. Uh, yeah. And let me. Just, I, I back up again. So basically, yes. I, I got out of the way, and then I backed up again behind yeah. the tank. Yeah. Cool. There we go. There you go. And then oh, yours, go. buddy. Ooh. Ulgrath. You used your uh, breath weapon, so you can't use that anymore. I will change that to preparation. Okay. Your breath weapon is one rest. There we go. Go up and then here. There we go. There. I'm trying to see if the bear is going to be a problem, basically, before I do anything else. The bear is just standing there, like uh, trying to look mean, but it's like a hamster on two. It's, it's like <laughs> tiny. That answers that question. <laughs> then <laughs> just kick it out of the way. Go over here. And okay. I'm going to smack him with my stick. At yeah. Least Slayer him. might look. Poorly. He he has a big smile on his tiny, giant face. As you approach him. Why does he have a big smile? That's not good. I gotta feed you to the blood drinker, my bear, my mighty bear. Oh, as you hit him. Ouch! <laughs> 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 he just, just like did one of those poked him with the end. I, I love this soundboard. It's so funny. Okay, so <laughs> gotta roll damage on him. Yeah. Drop that fool. Oh, Ooh, that is a six point of damage. Ow! Ah, you bastard! And my unarmed attack is missing again. It, it is. Uh, well because we didn't never make one, so we're gonna make one uh, really quick. There we go. On our yeah, last combat, where'd it go? I don't know. Because so just you keeps have freaking uh, disappearing for some reason. Yeah, yeah. There you go. Now it should be right. Yep. Fire it will. Starts talking, and I just want to play on that. Oh. 
All right, All right then. here we go. That's the end of what I can do. Okay, cool. Here we go. It's the mighty uh, Slayer time Mighty. Dick with a stick, basically. <laughs> yeah. Uh, 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 what assholes? Here are you this get hour? it, you bastard! And he throws a. Uh, uh, yeah. Mini javelin. He, yeah, no, he has a club. club. He has a club. You said throws, though. Is he throwing a freaking stick at me? He's gonna. He's, gonna <laughs> <hit> <laughs> he's had enough of your shit. <laughs> and with a 19, that is a hit. <laughs> I'm sorry. And he's oh my god! And um, wait, wait. The the, the great club still does. It's got to be half damage. Yeah, at that size, it shouldn't even technically be a great club anymore. It is. It it, it doesn't do the, how the damage is supposed to do, but it's it's one day six plus two. So, but he got another another attack. Oh boy. And it missed. Oh god, you're okay. lucky, man. He's still deadly. Mm -hmm. he just... and, uh, he's Wait, but he big. actually swung? Oh, or he... Stay still, you bastard! And it's new turn. It's Hankless. Okay, um... <sighs> I'm gonna get up alongside him over here. Oh, mighty. And you're gonna pull out your rapier? Yep, time to, try... yep. Time to attempt to finish this. Stab him. Stabby stabby. With the rapier on him. No. Oh, I, ah, I guess I got him. I, I, you bastard. Nice. That was good. I can handle shooting. you both. Yep, handle this. <laughs> he's critically wounded now. He's bleeding. Pro, pro, and he's I stabbed him through the liver. I don't feel well. <laughs> Pity that. Uh, uh, that and I'm in. I'm, I'm in my turn. Yeah, okay. <gasps> then we have Ulgrath. Why does that always make a taking damage sound? It's it's delayed. No, it's like, that it's your turn! Go! I, I don't know. No, nope. it's, uh, it's a delay on the sound. Try and jab him in the face with a stick again. To yep. Shut him up. Oh, that was Ooh, good. That was a hit. Oh, God. <laughs> Sounds juicy. Oh, God. <laughs> damage. Oh. Oh, I feel woozy. Oh, oh. What a the world! Blood, the blood. What a world, what a world. I'm melting. Shut up. Oh. Just take you, please. Next as well. Why are they always so talky here? Seriously. <laughs> Shut up and die. Oh. And he falls down. Yeah. <laughs> 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 uh, he falls down and he basically lies there, spread eagle dead. How the mighty have fallen! Yeah! Oh, yeah. Right, I can't do it. You want to kill the uh, hamster bear? Uh, I guess. Yeah, we should, should I just go step on it? We should go yeah, put him out of his misery. There's, there's a bear there standing, uh, and he doesn't look like he's feeling that well. He's shaking and he's lying there, like almost. Yeah, he doesn't look good at all. He, he, he looks like he's struggling with something. He's, he's he has some convulsions on him, but he's tiny. He's, he looks cute. He's like a hamster. You yep. gonna step on him? I'm um, yeah, go there. Um, then up there. Then just stomp on it. Yeah, yeah. He's like. Oh. <laughs> hey, he's I don't want it getting big again and attacking us. No, I know. Yeah, that, I know. I had to do it. Oh. Oh no! I kind I kind of look with like some distaste, but I I, I get it, you know. Just kind of okay. this, I wince a little. Yeah, he basically lying there. He like you I have to like really dirty clean, foot by clean now. your boots, clean, clean <laughs> right? your. Right. You got like four kinds, four kinds of uh, like a. Uh, I've got a dead fluid goblin's yeah. head on it. And now a hamster bear. The... All right, uh, search the body. Yeah, uh, on the body you find something. Yeah, you found uh, some sort of. Um, uh, yeah, it looks like you found a, a, a potion. It looks like a potion of healing, in fact. Nice. That is, that is nice to have. I toss it to the. Uh, I toss it to the dragonborn. I said, "Here, you might need this." It, I put it in the inventory. Uh, well, the on party the, inventory. Yeah. I, 
all treasures and stuff like that you have to distribute at the end of the session. Oh, okay, alright, never mind then. Well, yeah. I still but will roleplay it like that, I just toss it, it right to him. But... Uh, also, also uh, you find that he has, um, he has a necklace on him. Uh, is it magical? Can I sense uh, any magic from it? No. Well, do, do you have any sense magic? Uh, no, I don't think so. I'm not a mage. No. It, it, it looks like it's, it's a necklace made out of 20, 20 copper charms or whatever that it wears around his neck. But it probably didn't have that much. Okay. Okay. Uh, uh, so I, I'm going to put that in your inventory too. Okay. In your, uh, because it is, in fact, a treasure. Charm right. necklace. There we go. Slowly go towards the chest, keeping an eye out for anything Ooh. out of the ordinary. Yeah, it looks like. Stomp! 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 <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and uh, you, you get. Yeah, I'm to hanging the back. I want. To, I need to see what happens here. Yeah, you get to the chest, and uh, well, the chest is open. Ah. Uh, and they probably set off whatever was on that chest, and that's what shrunk them. <laughs> Probably that that that's 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 a good guess, but be and, careful. Uh, and uh, the stone chest is carved like uh, directly into the floor of the chamber. It's basically a, they made it out of one whole rock. Like stalact. Wow. Cool. Yeah, it has a heavy stone lid. Uh, that probably weighs several hundred pounds, but it's now resting against the the wall next to the chest. There are runes Thanks, carved giant. into the chest. And the lid, and the floor, in front of the chest. Okay, and you look in into the chest like really slow, or you just like leaning Real over. Slow. Yeah, it basically. Oh, look at it, Marion. Basically, the chest is empty, but there is a crumbled note at the bottom, like somebody's crumbled it. Great. And the, and uh, the note reads in common. By the way, I'll put it in. in <laughs> That's probably what it reads. Says, Stupid run giants of the hills, you are too slow and dim-witted to challenge us. The treasure is ours. You're probably feeling small now, aren't you? If you think you are going to prevail, you're mistaken. By the way, prevail means win, idiots. Clan True Nimbus <laughs> didn't mean to do that. of the Clouds. I'm gonna add that to our that notes. Clan Give me a That's a good idea. Do, uh, do an intelligence roll arcana if you have. Oh, no, no, no. <laughs> Well, I really hate the way this does things. There we go. Knowledge Arcana? Probably not. Let's see. Okay, we have a note in our list now. I I can do. Don't you? Do you have to be trained, or there's no trained and untrained skills anymore? No. Uh, yeah, it's no. If you have the skill, you can do a roll attempt. Well, I don't have the skill. Okay. Yeah. Uh, oh, I wait. don't know shit. Wait, 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 stop. It's not a flagged skill, so does that mean I don't know it? Uh, or does you, that mean you I... Know, you know it, but you don't have proficiency. Okay, in okay, fine. You, okay, you, so that... Don't have got it. You, you don't Anybody have can problem. roll any skill. Yes. It doesn't matter. All right, that's, that's cool. It's very simplified. All right, well, that's uh, fine. And, cool. and uh, you look at the, the rooms the on, on, oh. on the chest, and you realize... Uh, I don't think, yeah, you're the only one because Ur Ulgrath has no idea what it is. Uh, you, it reveals that the runes is part of a magical curse that causes the victim to shrink in size and stature. Mm, so looks... basically, those creatures here have befallen this oh, the curse. Well, they all piled into that room, huh? But you deduct that this type of curse is probably not permanent, so maybe killing that bear, bear. that would yeah, it was was maybe a good idea. I explain as such to Olgrath. Like, it looks like you might have made the right decision there. Distasteful as okay. it was, this was that that effect would have only been temporary. Squished good. So uh, <laughs> okay, so that is basically yeah, that is basically the first first part of the All first. Right. Now, how do we? Nothing. Okay, I think this is so, a good point to stop then. But uh, what do yeah. we need to upgrade here? Update for okay. our. Yeah, okay, so uh, first of all, I'm going to give you some XP. Wait, let me get rid of this thing. For adventures. Yeah. Uh, so the XP, now we're going to put that in this thing that I can't show people. 
Yeah. First, you need to take uh, the the items that is in then distributed amongst yourself. Except the necklace. The necklace is gonna be sold. Okay. So hold on a second. Um, opening that up that adventure. Get... Yeah. Uh. Be... Well, uh, you take the oh. healing potion. I'll take one alchemist fire. You take one alchemist fire. Let's do it that way. Okay. okay. So. so... I need... Just write it in the notes that you t taking those items. So, uh, the, like, uh, make a note of it. Like, yeah, taking right. a. So how do healing. I? How do I grab like this? On the dragon and move Just it to your. To grab the dragon and move it to your equipment. Okay, got it. So I took one. Does it actually? Did it actually do it right? It did. Okay, and the charm necklace we're gonna keep in the here. Yeah, yeah. because I, we're as, gonna sell as it. As far as we so, know, it's just loot. So oh, I'm who took it? it. Oh, you I sold it. I, yeah, I sold it. I'm gonna distribute the money you got. Okay, so now we're putting this in the. We're putting this in the. Yes. Yeah. So you where? get right. hundred gold each. Hundred gold each. Wow. Yeah. So that's just true. meant hundred. Yeah. Okay. One hundred. And then, then we're gonna give. I'm gonna give you the XP. So you get hundred. I will do that. That will happen automatically. That is. Uh, just give me a sec here. I'm Sorry, I can't show you this, guys. It has, uh, has his actual name here. I don't know how do I, I used to center myself so well. Oh, there we go. It was off for both of us nearly dying almost immediately. Yeah. yeah. That is level 1 D&D. That is level 1 D&D. Okay, so here comes some XP for you that it will automatically drop it in, but you have to write it down. And then just right. Yeah. Uh, uh, I will award it. There we go. You will get 125 XP each. To get the next level, you need 300. Okay. Okay. So that's a pretty and big then, chunk out of it. Mostly from then, the then, then, you, then you have some non combat awards. For saving Blood Drinker the Bear, you would have gotten 25 XP. So that didn't happen. For saving him? Yeah. Or sparing him, you mean? Because you uh, sometimes uh, the. the, the the, you get something called story awards and here's what you would have missed out if you saved this blood drinker I will put it in chat but you didn't get it I'm just gonna write because sometimes you get like story awards oh fuck uh, that that's was Dwarven I think uh, that, that is Goblin there yeah, we go. Dwarven would actually make sense because I know Dwarven <laughs> yeah point uh, there you go uh, that is, so caring uh, patients, you now have a bear pet. She is, however, the size of a small house cat. She cannot attack, defend, distract, old or otherwise, play any role in combat. And she can be taught to do simple tricks if treated well, and you spend 20 downtime with her. Basically, you, you had a pet pet bear if you saved her. And it, 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 one of you would have a, have a pet bear. There you go. <laughs> Aww. It's funny. Yeah, okay. I, I think the yeah. dragon would have been like, yeah, fuck that anyway. Yeah, uh, also... <laughs> Also, you get you get five downtime days. And so we're putting this in the the session, yeah. Yeah, in the log. Right. Five downtime added to that. Okay. Yeah. So right now? then you add uh, add everything up, and uh, you can go on your merry way and maybe do the next one next time. Well, I I would like to continue with you on this. Yeah. So yeah, all right. But... So that's that for this is this session. Now the adventure notes. We put this stuff in here now, or. Yeah. Uh, yeah, you in the event note you put uh, like wh wh what items you got because you got you got like a potion and uh, so right. uh, so I basically cut and paste everything I put in Notepad. Right, story. Yeah, you can do that, that too. Like, you, you can, can do, do that too. Uh, so you have first treasure gone. And you get no rebound now and no magical items, and then you add up everything. No renown? Okay. No renown and no the only way you can get renown is by being member of an organization. Alright, cool. And you said it automatically did our experience gold on yeah. the sheet. Oh okay. If you go uh, to experience, you see on your main tab you have Oh a, I could show you guys again, hang on a second. Just on the main tab. Okay. I just had to click on my level. Yeah. And then if you go to uh, next level, you just write 300 there as a reminder. You need 300 to Where get Where is that under? Level. Under under, like under level. Uh, on the class and level, there's like a spyglass. Just click on it. 
and then it will yeah. and then just write 300 on next level it will give. oh next level oh so type in that for the 300 here yeah like that because okay. there, are, there are three different ways of uh, calculating xp all right yeah, and yeah. now in the if i look in our inventory or where's the money uh stored it's automatically on the updated, but it's set on, on the gp on the gp it says you have it's under inventory Let's yeah see. Okay, so now 110. Nice. Okay, cool. Yeah. Awesome. And so that, that leaves is, you uh, with eight minutes to eat something. <laughs> All right. So I'm yeah. uh, cool, man. So, cool first uh, first session here. Uh, it's, 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 <laughs> it's, it's, I'm surprised it's, we survived. Oh yeah, this this game is really designed for three to six players. So you did it really. With two players. So we got lucky then. <laughs> Is what you're saying? Yeah, but the thing is, uh, yeah, they you only needed to kill one of them to for the rest of them to survive. So, and this game will scale up if there was like the more players, it will scale up. All right, so so, you, so it was scaled. Player. Okay. Yeah. So it wasn't so, so it, one. It, it's designed that way. It's basically like small adventures, like one you can do it in one night. I suppose but, we're lucky. I actually moved down when we uh, first came into the cave. Because if I hadn't, they might have all shot you. Oh yeah, maybe. But the lesson is here to be be try to stealth if you can. Yeah, be be as cautious as possible. Yeah. Also, don't assume uh, because you have something called passive uh, perception. Okay. Right. That yeah. it. That is what I used. So you had to have a passive perception of sixteen or more to spot them. Uh, the other way is to do a actual perception roll, yeah, like an actual check perception. Or the yeah, yeah. Right. So if you don't do a spot check, I used to add the passive perception you have on on your characters. Gotcha. And, and Sorry, guys. On, I gotta go though. And, yeah, cool. Ready. Yeah, I didn't, I didn't mean to cut you off, but I have to. I have to get ready. All right, um, Fluffy, thank you again. Spoon, thank you, and uh, I'll talk to you guys uh, tomorrow, or maybe even later if I get settled in. But uh, I'll talk to you guys. Okay. Cool. All right. Peace.